What's wrong with my green screen today? I didn't do anything to it. Now it's all goofy. Oh. Oh. Hi, everybody. Welcome back. Oh, I know what happened to my green screen. My OBS froze last night. And I neglected to, um, to fix it. Let's see if I can fix it right now. If not, it might be one of those non green screen nights there good enough we'll just ignore it I'll be a lot smaller soon ah <sighs> hi hi dominator hi B type hi me <sighs> oh apparently there's yelling happening in the background but that's okay um we're gonna play some more What's that game called that we're playing tonight? Oh, right. We're playing some um, Prison Architect tonight. We're going to finish up um, with... Well, not finish up. We're going to work on it a little bit, I think. Let's see what... Oh, if I move in such a way, it goofs up the green screen. I think it's time for better lighting in here. Um, stuff and things. Amanda's running into the room. What the hell is Remember that? Remember those things? No. 
She's got this like weird thing on her face. I've got the like. Like her face is on her face. It's really quite. Don't don't look at me. Don't look at me. Don't look at me, guys. I do, Dominator. I do use OBS for live streaming. Um, I use NVIDIA Shadowplay for local recording. Yeah. So anyway, B-Type says hello, by the coming. way. She's coming right now. So anyway, uh, apparently... Are you uh, playing? Oh, Prison Architect. Playing, we're playing Prison Architect. Apparently, this is the last alpha before they release the game into beta. Wow. Well, that'll be interesting. Anyway, I think we'll continue. Um, we'll see how this night goes. Might end up a little early. We do need to change up the schedule a little bit because everybody has gone back to school. It's after Labor Day. And I think that will affect how many people come and hang out with us. So, we'll probably do something like that. Anyway. Let's do it. Let's play some prison architect. in the old swing of things aren't we back in prison architect it's nighttime it looks like it just became nighttime and all the prisoners are going to sleep well I think they're all sleeping aren't they it is sleep time so that's good uh, who's this it's Darren lying I thought we had camp camera oh oh she it okay well it's uh it's time we found a hole. Who got out? This... Who got out? We found a hole, like, literally right away. And we don't know what happened. How do I just search a cell block? Search cell block. It's time. You guys are getting searched. I don't care what time it is. Look, there's a freaking tunnel here. So, uh, apparently... It's gonna, we're gonna search everyone. I don't care if you're sleeping, you sons of bitches. You're getting searched right now. You weren't gonna make it very far. But, since we found a tunnel. Hi, Kenlord. Good evening. Um, you wanted to stream Agario, but didn't have the recording software. Yes, use, use Shadowplay or OBS or XSplit, FF Split. There's this new one, Meerkast. There's lots out there. I just so happen to use OBS because um, I've used it since I started streaming. And it's pretty good. It's pretty good. There we go. It looks like we're doing some, some hardcore searching of people right now. I tapped out for a second. Apologies. So it looks like we found a tunnel, but we don't know where we found the tunnel to and from. Like, really? How do we... He didn't find anything. So who tried to get out with the tunnel? Hmm. Very interesting. Very, very... 12 prisoners are up for parole? Okay, so, let's have a look here. Um... Um... Forget how to play. Oh, not that one. Is it this one? This one. This one. No, I clicked that already. How do I get to the thing? Oh, here we go. Uh, intake. How many prisoners do we have? Uh, prisoners. Low risk 18, normal risk 24, high risk 12. Uh, we have 26 here, I think. <laughs> 28. So we can get four low risk. 
And then one, two, three, four, five, six, twelve. Twenty. Alright, four low risk or four normal risk and two low risk. Four. Four normal risk. Four normal risk and two normal and yeah, like that. There we go. Good enough. So we'll get some more guys. And that'll be good. Um, what do we need to do? What do we need to do? Good evening, Yuri. X split is kinda ish. I don't mind it, but it's not what the fuck? My camera's all like my my green screen's all messed up. Look. I raise my arm and it goes crazy. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's silly. Might be one of those nights. Maybe my hat's too white. I don't know. I'm wearing my knockoff Disney hat, by the way. But we're just going to ignore that fact. Okay. So it's shower day. Uh oh, we're having some danger. 30 prisoners have serious complaints. Why? What are you guys complaining about? Well, William... You totally goofed up and um, may or may not have tried to break out of prison or like killed some, Hello, killed a man. So I really don't feel terrible at all about uh, having you pissed off. Apparently this guy needs a shower. Look, we made shower time a long, re really long for these guys. Here, if we go medium, medium speed. Why don't we see anything? I think I need, uh, I need another prisoner around here. And I guess all these people. Wow, this didn't work at all. Um, I think what happened last time, I need a guard. Interesting. It's like, everybody's having a shower. Like all these people. Okay, I'll tell you what. What's going on? I am so confused right now as to what's going on in my prison. Huh? I guess, I guess not. I don't know why. Like, I got a camera here, but apparently they don't, like, go far enough. So I might have to install another couple. Like, I played yesterday. Nobody really liked it. I don't know why. I had, like, a ton of fun playing it. Holy shit. We have a lot of problems. Dominators coming to oh, shit. Recreation. Apparently this guy is all mad because he needs recreation. Well, what did I, what did I do wrong here? Are we having like fights? Are we having big fights? No, we're not having fights. Okay. Jeez, this prison is getting a little, pr little bit like crazy. Here. Adrian wants to know when you're going to look for these guidelines again. Uh, in a... A little while. Not for a while. I think we're going to we're gonna have um, a little bit of a break from cities. Just for, you know, the time being. Um, yeah. Yeah, a little while, though. It won't be too, too long. Okay, so... Did we get our prisoners? I think we did. 50 days, 60, yeah, okay, so no intake. That'll be fine. Uh, we have lots of prisoners with big complaints. Apparently, they all want recreation or something, so we're giving them some recreation and freedom. That's fine. Uh, we did get a new regime anyway. Oh, my goodness, you idiot. Who are you? Who are you? Felix Griffin. Since seven years for aggravated vehicle theft. Unbelievable. Look at these guys. They're doing their thing. This guy's sitting on a chair. These guys are just chilling out. What? Oh, I saw that. I saw that, William. What? We're gonna... We're gonna search you. You son of a bitch. Alright, William. Something's happening. Something's happening, but I don't see it. I hear it. What? What's going on? 
Oh my goodness. It, things are happening so fast. I don't know what's going on. <gasps> what happened? That guy had a shiv? This guy needs to take a wee and he had scissors and now he's gonna go. Like, these prisoners are terrible. I tell you. They're horrible people. Really. And now we need to feed everyone. Okay, look. The danger level is going down. That was weird. Just It's just so much stuff is happening so quick because our prison is getting a lot bigger. So, uh, we need to get our workshop all set up. Um, that's probably not going to happen. I'm just like staring at the prison trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing. Can I have to kill these materials? Alright, grass. So we're going to grass in, you know, like this stuff here just so that it looks really nice around the place there we go this guy oh my god he overdosed grant overdosed you stupid man i i feel that i should everything seems to be getting slightly out of hand here yeah <laughs> we're gonna dismantle that door we don't need that door anymore we're putting in a bunch of grass here leading into the workshop okay um golly we still don't have enough smart people for the library uh our classrooms aren't being used right now lawrence is just chilling out oh my good i must be type this is this is slightly it's getting out of hand I mean, all these guys, they better be good because there is an armed guard right here patrolling shit out of everywhere. Like, we had some... I think they were all upset because we we changed our, our regime ever so slightly. And um, they didn't really like it. But that's too bad. I feel that the maximum security guys um, really should stay in their own yard. Which they are, so that's good. So they're not intermingling with the... Uh, with the bad guys so that's fine this guy here is going for a poo is he going for a poo oh he's going for a poo right uh oh jackson and did jackson oh, okay no jackson was fine so what i'm thinking we're gonna do um is we're going to build another kind of what's the word canteen for the um medium security guys so that way um they don't have to intermingle with the, the 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 low security guys. We're just gonna do that. That way we don't have like shower water everywhere. What's up? Oh hello, Shadow Vito Pinky plays. Good evening. What the hell happened here? Why is there all so much crap on the ground? Apparently, Aries in the mood for multiplayer blast off. Mm. Oh. This guy. Who's this? Jesus. Dan Stubbs had drugs. Dan. Dan, you terrible man. Okay, so let's start planning out a little bit of um, the, uh, the canteen slash kitchen for the low security guys. I mean, I'm fine with them ch chilling out and hanging out together in the, in the common areas here, but I don't want them to eat together, which... Uh, seems like a terrible idea. So what we'll do is I think we'll kind of hook it up here, right? So we'll have like something come like this and this and this will be like the canteen and I think how big's the tables? Uh, they're one, two, three, four. They're four squares. So we'll have like a table here right? And a table here. That's not big enough. So that's why we're doing this, right? To try and figure out how big of a room we need to do. Speaking of Blast Off, Yuri, I was actually playing it over the weekend. Um, just because. I wanted to see if I could actually do it. And I'm, I think it's, it's going okay. One, two, three, four. So we'll have three tables, I think, should be enough for these guys. So that'll be good. And then what we'll do is we'll have, uh, where do the serving tables go? Okay, so they're just like one, two, three, four, five. They're five. It's kind of like that. So if we have, if we just get rid of this and we go, um, and maybe we'll like kind of make it this big. Just kind of like that. And then we'll have, um, 
if we put our serving tables one, two, three, like that, we'll have like three serving tables just like that. And then that way we can do, we can put up a small kitchen, kind of maybe like here. And they can cook up and do their own thing inside here. And, you know, have a door there just to kind of get in and out of the kitchen. And then I guess this doesn't have to be this big. So we can kind of go like that, I think. And maybe we'll make the kitchen ever so slightly bigger. There. So we'll have the kitchen here with like a staff only door coming out so that they can, you know, do their own thing, bring in the foods and the goods and shit. And then. Okay, cool. So let's do it. Uh, uh, let's do this. Uh, making a nice brick building, right? So that'll be like that. And then this will be like that. Oh, I can't do that. It won't let me. Um, I have to do it kind of this way, maybe. So we'll do it like that. And then what we'll do is we'll do a, I know you guys are talking to me. I apologize. I will, I will get to you right away. Um, I'll do big door right there. Okay, great. Hello. This will be good. Ah, oh. excellent. Oh, Hatham, hello. Try watching on YouTube, Hatham. Um, there we go. Okay, so that'll be good. I'm thinking we're going to put some lights in the yard. One, you know, two, three. Just to make this place a lot prettier. Yard lights and whatnot. These guys are busy, busily building away the... Um, the new the new canteen for the low security guys that'll be good i think what we'll do is we'll actually make their own yard and stuff over here too just for the the low security guys that way oh shit, you dumbasses build that wall really quick because this guy's got no house now to live in jesus okay there we go they built it up so we'll kind of build that up like that there's trees inside the there's trees inside the kitchen. Holy cow. Okay. Where's it may be. I don't know why. It shouldn't be. We haven't dropped any frames tonight, unlike the other night, where it was totally crap. So do that, and then we'll bring in a large pipe, kind of like that. Excellent. And then what we'll do is we're going to get some objects in. We'll get ourselves the tables that we promised ourselves. And then we'll get our benches that we promised ourselves. It could be YouTube today. Holy cow. Are you? How is it for you, honey? That's very odd. I think I, I feel that I fixed my problems that I was having yesterday with my computer. So, theoretically, it shouldn't lag. Uh, we're gonna lock these doors open. How do I? Uh, locked open. Here we go. Hooray! That's very strange. It shouldn't be. Is everybody else having problems today? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, it is. It is mighty laggy today. Apparently, it shouldn't be though. Surprise! But Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Nameless Empire. Thanks for hanging out. Muchly appreciate you guys hanging out with us tonight. Hopefully, you're enjoying um, um, Prison Architect more than the other night what we did when we were just janitors i mean i enjoyed myself playing janitor simulator it was a lot of fun actually what am i doing this is a mail room oh we should get a mail room and a reception uh we'll have to build those in in a bit um holding cells office cleaning cupboard infirmary more kitchen kitchen canteen here we go canteen so that'll be canteen and then this will be kitchen Great. And then what we'll do is we'll get a ser oops, serving table. One, two, three serving tables, just like that. There's nothing in here for you guys. What are you doing? There's no food here. Go to the other kitchen. 
Oh, they're gonna be like mighty upset about not having any food because well the kitchen doesn't really exist quite yet uh, Cooker Got a couple of the old cookers in one. Did I do this the right way? I don't know. I Didn't okay. We'll get a couple of cookers in and Fridges in uh, get two fridges, two cookers, and then we'll get uh, somebody out of fork. Oh my god! Okay, and then we'll get a couple sinks in. Perfect. Okay, so our kitchen, our second kitchen is all good to go. We'll get ourselves another staff door for here. That'll be great. What a yeah, cooker, fridge, and sink. Perfect. So then this will be ready to rock right after. Um, I apologize to the low security guys about not having anything to eat um that sucks to be them i know i know i heard about that you can make babies in the multiplayer blast off i've seen it and i thought it was hilarious as hell oh that's not hooked up hook up oh you can't well, shit. Okay, fine. We'll, uh... We'll do it that way, then. <laughs> the perimeter wall. Oh, I see. Where? What are you doing? Oh, he's serving dinner. On the tables. Oh, isn't that cute? Okay, so we'll get... There's CCTV in here. That'll be good. So this guy's all ready to cook and do some cooking and stuff. Oh, I'm really happy about this. Got a waste bin. Right there. Great. Uh, we're going to have to uh, dismantle that one. Because, well. Obviously. Okay, so great. And now that we have this. Um, oh, this is so good. Okay, and then we'll get ourselves a couple. Uh, not those. Not those. Um, what are they called? Metal detectors, that's what they're called. Metal detectors. We'll set it up, like. One here, and you know, one here, I guess. Okay, I'll take that thing down, just like so. There we go, we'll put it up another metal detector. And then we'll have to pull one more cable to it. Perfect, excellent. We got two metal detectors. This will hook up, connecting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. If I connect this to here, that work? Or I have to do it the other way? Oh, it just like. Where's the guard that's gonna spo that's supposed to watch the stupid thing? Get over there and watch it. Oh, there he is. Jeez. Okay. Did these guys do what they're supposed to do with the sinks and stuff? I guess not. What's happening here? Do I have to put pipes like right to the sinks? I'll just kind of do that. There. I put pipes like straight to the sinks. Now what we'll do is we shall what deployment here we go so this here will be minimum security only right minimum security only great there we go so now this will all be minimum security only so they'll only be able to you know make minimum security food and minimum security drinks and food waste what the hell dude there's a bin for that and yet you guys oh see nobody nobody actually got lunch yet again in minimum security um because they didn't kind of start cooking until it was too late oh shit this guy had a shovel man i think what we'll do is right when it becomes sleep time 
Right when it becomes sleep time, uh, these sons of bitches are getting a shakedown. shakedown. They're gonna get a shakedown. But what we're gonna do is, I mean, since this is really lovely, minimum security, whatnot, right? We're gonna get some fancy tiles in the canteen. I, I know we can afford it. Look, we can afford it, right? Why are we making so little money now? What's happening? Uh, I don't know. Apparently, we're making like not a, a lot of money, but it's okay. Great. Okay. Oh shit. Mr. T again with your stupid like oh my goodness everybody's got garden shears okay it's lockup time which means it's time for a shakedown let's do it all right boys whole prison's getting shaken down everybody is getting out of hand so it's time for a shakedown I don't care what anybody says but they're gonna put up some fancy tiles and we're gonna have a shakedown we're gonna see apparently we found a bunch of stuff and that's not good it's just not good. We uh, we can't do that anymore. We have four people in solitary confinement. I mean, look at this idiot. Bob. Bob. Dumbass. Look at this guy. Found, he had a weapon, Warren Hill. I can't believe it. All right. Oh, my web my webcam's all broken. Everything everything seems to be just not working. Look at this. If I sit all weird, my webcam gets goofed up. Hmm. I don't know what happened to it. It just magically, it just stopped working all of a sudden one day. All right, so we're still doing a shakedown. Uh, all these people, everything has to be searched. Hopefully, okay, so what do we need to do to get um, regime intake prisoners? Prisoners, how are we doing for those? 16 and 24, we can get four more low risk. It looks like so low risk oops I didn't know you could move that four more low risk because I think one two yeah three four more low risk it looks like yeah good we got four more low risk guys it'll be fine we're shaking down the whole prison still cooks are kind of going oh you son of a bitch stubs Oh my god. Wow, this guy has so many cell phones. Crying out loud. Mr. T, it looks like... Chislet. What, what's his name? Gareth Chislet Trim. Unbelievable Gareth Chislet Trim, you son of a bitch. Where's this guy? He's got to go to solitary because he had drugs. Holy crap, this prison is getting out of hand. I tell you. We're going to have to... So, oh, right. Uh, speaking of laundry and whatnot, so I think, uh, you know, all four, we filled all four of the jobs. Okay, so we filled the jobs, filled the jobs. We'll get three guys in there, one guy in there, we're in there. Okay, good. Uh, hello. Good evening. Okay, um, needs. Apparently, these guys need sleep. Yeah. Uh, apparently guys want literacy so as far as programs go kitchen and safety they're getting it workshop safety instruction okay so we got some people in workshop great uh, alcoholics anonymous that's good we got lots of parole hearing uh, spiritual guidance carpentry apprenticeship nobody's qualified guard laser okay so we're gonna get the guard laser um, guard taser stuff so we're gonna get that uh, nobody's passed the foundation education program. They're really stupid. Um, but it sucks to be them. Okay. We'll get a couple of those. Uh, it looks like we need to hire some more guards. Uh, actually, it's not true. That's good. Okay. And then we'll get a couple. Hi, Pinky. Good night. Thanks for hanging out. Lawyer, psychologist, armed guard, doctor, gardener. We have 10 gardeners. That was taking them so long to do anything. All right, so these guys are cooking up. They're, they're quickly quickly beavering away, cooking up uh, food for the next day for the real bad sons of bitches in minimum security. Um, I was thinking... Um, how many connections do we have coming out not here 
Holy shit. That's intelligence. I see. Apparently, there's lots of supply of weapon and tools. B-Type says cooking safety. Leave all the knives on the top shelf, tip pointing out, and be sure to blow out the pilot light. Yeah. That sounds like a great idea. Okay, so. Um, we're going to concrete paving stones. So we were going to make some paving stones through here so that these guys could kind of kind of go where they need to go really quick. So that'll be good. Uh, yeah, it's on. It's on. I don't know if anybody plays on it anymore, but it is definitely on. Oh, shit. I'm buying everybody tasers. All right, what are we doing? We haven't had any of that. Adrian's going to bed, too. Okay. Good night, Adrian. Thanks for hanging out. And I know it's a little late for the East Coasters. If you guys are East Coast or Central Time, apologies. Six visitors are, or six prisoners are up for parole. Um, did we get those new prisoners? It looks like we did. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna close the intake to people. That'll be good. 53 of 64. Maximum capacity 10. Uh, minimum capacity 20. Medium capacity 28. So we got four more normal. Four more normal. Alright. And one more maximum. Oh, okay. So... So, four more normal, and one more maximum. Okay, here we go. So, we're going to get some more bad sons of bitches. Oh, I think because one of these guys died or something. It looks like we need another table. So, we might have to expand upon this. Well, yeah, I think one of the maximum security guys died uh, the other day. So, that... that I mean, it happens. No. It might be an old version. I haven't updated it for a while. Oh, look at that. Somebody got out. Who got out? Who got out? Somebody got out. That's great. Where'd they go? No, they they got they got on parole. Wow, that's great. Look at these guys, they're in the reform program. Oh, look at this. The doctors are teaching right now. This is so good. Everything is working out really nicely. So these guys are building uh, a bigger building. Okay, that's great. So we're building the bigger canteen for the maximum security guys. Just so they have a couple tables to sit at. That'll be nice for them. Look at this. They are. They're making plates. Welcome back, Dominator. Hey, hello. Welcome back, Dominator. This guy is doing it. He's doing it. He's making a workshop saw. Oh, somebody has cigs. Who had cigarettes? Robert Arctic Zagami. Somebody who paid to get their name in the game that's great so i wonder what these guys are making right now they're wood all right this is this is excellent these guys are operating oh yes we're making some money now license plates and whatnot uh produce 30 license plates so how do i make them actually produce license plates Does anybody know uh policy programs evaluation Finance? No. Exports. Oh, look, we've exported $2,550 worth of, of stuff yesterday. That's great. Uh, still, nobody's passed foundation education program. That uh, That's terrible. Um, Sublock C we have next. Carpentry. Uh, prison manufacturing. So, we're still trying to do that. So, what I'm thinking here. Uh, just, uh, escape tent is locked, locked down. Oh, okay, so what we're gonna do is if they found anything, they're gonna get their cell searched. Pretty much. They're gonna get their cell searched. And then anything else? That's gonna happen. Alright. We're gonna become pretty badass here in prison. Apparently people need some recreation. Um I don't know how we're going to do that. 
Why do they even need recreation in in prison? I don't think you need recreation. You sons of bitches. You don't need recreation. Okay. Oh right. So we made the can the canteen slightly bigger here. So that's good. Uh, what we'll do is we're going to get some more like another table and chairs for these guys. Look, table and two park benches. Look at that. That's great. So now um, they'll be able to have that kind of thing there and then we'll get um, we'll replace that with concrete walls so that'll be good uh, these guys I don't know why they're not like wanting to do anything but they're just not wanting to do anything I give them all the stuff they need to you know like um, what's the word oh you know what we don't we didn't have we didn't give them any we any metal detectors huh no but you know what these are these are fairly you know well behaved oh see somebody had sigs and guess what their shit's gonna get searched now are they getting searched yeah he, his, his cell's getting searched yeah that's right you don't have cigarettes in my place jerk are suppressed compliant i don't know what that even means all right, so now the meals are going are being served up, which means they're going into their respective canteens. You know, the medium security guys will come into this canteen. The low security guys will come into this canteen, grab their dinner, and uh, go. What I think we're gonna do is we're gonna deploy a guard patrol, like kind of like that. Is that not is that not good enough? There we go. Got a guard patrol in here. Uh, we theoretically should do it with the dog, but I think we'll be fine So there we go, that's great um, So now we should get a guard like whisking away. Here we go. He's going on patrol. He's got keys and a stab vest and whatnot So that's good. Okay, so these guys have finished up their lunch They're being patrolled Is anyone okay? They are watching the cameras These guys here like look at this canteen. Isn't it just quite lovely? Uh, speaking of which, we have to actually expand the canteen over into here. There we go. What's wrong? There are no prisoners assigned to eat this canteen. No, it's fixed, but it's all good. Okay, so that's good. Is it possible to switch game midstream? Yeah. I haven't done that for a long time, though. Ah. Okay. Great. So now we get the worker emptying the recycle or emptying the trash bins. And it's lock up time, which means everybody should be in their cells. It's good. Okay. Uh great. This uh this makes me happy. What we'll do is I think we'll make these guys have their own yard. Like this will be kind of shared and minimum security type thing. Or what we could do. Hmm. Wow. Prisoner Warren Hill. He's in solitary for an hour. Idiot. Shouldn't have done anything bad. Okay. A tree grew in the middle of the path. That's um something that happens. Apparently. Everybody's in their cell. What's wrong with you? Yeah. Yeah. No. It's actually like a path path, but I did, I may or may not have, have set it up so that it would be, um, what's it called? Thing. Sure. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, totally yeah. All right. So we're going to make, oh, look, this guy's cutting the tree down. It's fine. So we're going to make the, um, where's the shower? Oh, right. The shower's here. We're going to make the shower quite nice. For these guys in a uh, medium security prison shower is quite nice in, in low security that's that's quite lovely um, I don't think anyone's actually made license plates yet but that's fine uh, concrete floor and door only concrete tiles here we go the concrete tiles inside the workshop because I think that's a requirement uh, so that's good uh, the janitor is like moving the laundry baskets and stuff around so it looks like everything's working like a well oiled machine. Oh my goodness, look at how nice this shower is becoming. So when everybody wants to get up and you know, shower next to you know, Jim Bob and, and, and Floyd. 
Yeah, I went there. Jim Bob and Floyd want to, you know, shower together. They totally can. Um. Great. Okay. So everything seems to be fairly happy. Everybody is just, you know, beavering away at their own, at their own uh, jobs. We got some something like that going on, like that going on. I feel like this place does need a little bit of a spruce up, so we're doing it. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at the workshop now. What the hell? I need a better green screen. It's not my camera. It's my lighting in here. That's terrible. My I had it mint before, and then my lighting changed, or I changed my green screen settings around. It's because it's not stretched tight. And look, I can move it like this, and then it just gets all good. See, if I do that, then it's better. And then, yeah, whatever. So, it's my, it's my shitty green screen. But at least I have one. It's all good though. We're just gonna ignore it. We're gonna ignore it. We're gonna play the game. We're gonna play the game like, like Jesus intended it. Okay. Uh, sure. Do you think Jesus intended us to play this game? Cool. Okay. So, uh, we spent a lot of money. We've put some paving stones down, but now these guys can like zoom everywhere, which is nice. Um, I think what we'll do is we're gonna get some more grass like in this area and I think what I've done is I probably nullified these paving stones so if we do that that'll be good great okay excuse me all right we're getting our prisoners in um, do I have room for these prisoners yes yes I do so it looks like a bunch of guys got out maximum security 9 minimum security 19 no security 20. Yes, we have room for them. So that's good. Okay, so we're getting some new guys in. Some... What the hell did I just put here? What did I put in here? I thought I put grass in here. Did I not put grass in here? Oh, I put gravel. Here, we'll put grass instead. Whoops. There we go. There we go. That, that, I put gravel in by accident, not grass. That that was a mistake. But it's fine. Okay, good. Four prisoners up for parole. We're getting more guys in 19 minutes. That's really good. The gardener is gardening away quickly. Oh, this is nice. Okay. All these guys are having showers in here. Look at this guy's hair. Luth Sean Lutheran. What? I think we need some more shower heads in here. What do you think? Yeah, they're all waiting to have showers, right? Rather than all being able to shower kind of at the same time. Kind of waiting to have a shower. So we'll put... Look, they're all done, though. Where's this guy going? Oh, he's going to visitation. What a, what a champion. And now they're going to go eat. This guy's up for parole. Apparently needs recreation and drugs. I have a feeling that he's not going to get out. Uh, just saying. This guy, he might get out. We'll see though. That's great. Okay, so we got a bunch of new guys here. So we'll turn this off for now. And then we'll see. Nathan says WTF is this game. It's Prison Architect. It's where you build a prison. And hopefully people don't riot and kill each other. That's the whole name of the game. And to make it look really pretty. So we're going to make it look really pretty. This guy's name is Uranus. Marsman Mars Uranus. Here we go. Alright, Marsman. He's, uh, he's convicted of bribery. I probably do. I probably do need a diffuser. Because oh, I have two light sources right here. If I had one in the middle with a diffuser, it would totally work better. I know, I'm too cheap. Cheapness has come. It's totally fucked, isn't it? It is. I had it fixed before, and then what I did was I changed my sources around, and then, well, all hell broke loose. Look, that's my green screen. It's really shitty. Oh, I'm gone. I can totally goof with it and make myself better. Ah. No, I'm making it worse, aren't I? 
anyway, it's my it, it's a shitty camera. It's everything just shitty. There we go. I, I may have fixed it a little bit better. I doubt it. No, you can still see us. It. Fucking, it's, it's really good. who cares? I don't. I don't today. Zagami again. You dumb dumb. Yeah, you go to solitary, and we're gonna check out yourself. We didn't find anything, lucky guy. This guy's got a taser. This guard, he doesn't care. He's got a taser and a stab vest. Like, he's ready for all. For everything. Oh, what is this guy teaching? Foundation education. Attendance is shit. He has a really bad chance. Like, oh, this guy might be the first guy to pass. Tim Moss. He has a success chance of passing of 94%. Yeah, nice work, Tim. All right, so they got some free time. Now they can go and do whatever they want, like poo and pee and stuff. Uh, looks like a couple guys wanted to take some leaks, so here we go. Oh, oh, Dole! He needs drugs! Oh shit, Dole! You idiot! I don't know why you decided that drugs were a good idea, but they're not. And now look, you're in solitary confinement and they're gonna search your cell. So if you have anything else, man, you're going to the big house. You're totally going to the big house. So what I think we're gonna do, like, oops, ever so slowly, is we're gonna start improving the life of the uh, low risk prisoners. Look, they get like nice, they get nice cells that have hardwood floor in them. Look at this. These guys have really not, they don't have a really shitty time in prison. They're like, man, this place is nice. We've got some windows here. I got hardwood floor in my jail cell. Th that guy doesn't get a window, whoever that is. Oh, he can have a window. We'll put it right, we'll put it right there. Yeah, that guy can have a window too. Great, there we go. So now they're just chilling out. Like this guy here, he's cal suppressed with calming. He needs some sleep, Tom. It's time for the yard. Everybody get out in the yard. Oh, I'm really enjoying this actually. This is great. Excellent. So now they're they're beavering out. Oh, see, look. Um, what can I buy? Bank loan? Nah, I don't need bank loan. Legal. Big legal consequences. Careful work to keep. Heat off you should something go wrong needs to be done in advance. Small cells. Doesn't, he doesn't have an anti -heat vest, does he? A what? I don't know. Oh, an anti B vest. <laughs> I think I agree though with um legal defense. Legal prep. Jesus, I don't have 50 grand. Well, I do have 50 grand, but I don't want to spend it. We're gonna go clone. All right, there we go. I think we're probably gonna be at like the maximum of. What's up? Yeah. There we go. I think I think we've done all right here in our um oh young. No, just keep it. Oh my god, Young, you dumb dumb. Ian Young. What do you think? You got 22 years. Look at all these guys. They're terrible. Terrible human beings. Look at that. What are you doing over there, Carter? Guess what? You're going to solitary now. Jeez, you probably shouldn't have been such a terrible human. Oh, Lee. Okay. So, it looks like... How many chefs do we have? We only have eight. Got one there. Got another one there. Uh, yeah, there's four guys in there. That'll be fine. Okay, great. Excellent. Okay, so. It's time for lockup. Oh my goodness, look at this. Brucefield, Drummer, and McGann all are taking stuff and they're trying to, like, make an escape. Look at this. No. No, why are you running off? If you've... McGann. Just keep white black separated. Yeah, no. Keep white black separated. No. Follow your B knuckles. <laughs> oh, that's great. 
Okay. Wow. This is great. Our prison looks really good, actually. So, yeah. We'll make... What we'll do. Uh, I'll get another... Um, fence. I think we'll go kind of like this. And we'll go like... Uh, that almost worked. We'll do that. And then... Is anybody even in this jail cell? No. Okay, that's perfect. So we'll get them to build that, and then we'll have this, like, the exit to the, um, the yard in the middle. So that'll be fine. And then what we'll do is we'll build another... Oh my god, smell this. That's good. We'll have another, um, no, it's okay. We'll have another cell block here for low security guys. And what we'll do, 30,000? Yeah, let's do it. We'll unlock here, right? And then we'll build another medium security cell block here. What's wrong with this guy? He really needs alcohol, apparently. He is. So Dominator wants to know because you followed on Twitch. Yes. And you got the follow, but it's not up on the top. The top has a cheese. Because I didn't open that. I, I forgot to open something. I uh, my bad. It should eventually. Or not, at all. <laughs> I don't know why it didn't change. It'll eventually go. It'll come into its element. Um. Okay, great. So everything seems to be pretty good. Everybody's pretty happy. Who's this guy? Ed Merwood. Since nine years for multiple crimes, including robbery, perjury, and perjury. Wow. Oh, here we go. Did they build the fence? They did build the fence. Nathan Nathaniel says, okay, this is like Minecraft bow, correct? So, this is like Minecraft bow, correct? Well, I guess so. I had my camera perfect yesterday. That actually is bugging me. If I move it back, nope, that makes it worse. If I move it forward, what happens if I put it really close to me? Nah, that doesn't work at all. I haven't changed the lights in here at all. Anyway. Whatevs. Whatevs. No, of course not. Why would that change anything? Okay. Everybody in my jail is sleeping now. So what we'll do? Okay. Uh, one. Hmm. Canteen is kind of in the middle. How are we actually? Okay. Well, what we can do is we can kind of have the shower leading into the main. So we can move the shower somewhere else. Uh, that'll be fine. Move the shower somewhere else. And then we'll have the yard kind of in the middle for all the people. Um. Uh, Okay, that'll be fine. And then we'll get, like, some couches and stuff that they can... Oh, I think so. Like, a couple sofas. Look at this. We'll put a sofa here and a sofa here just because. Right? That'll be nice. I have a couple sofas in the common room in the minimum security prison part. It won't, unfortunately. Um, so anyway, let's, um, can I just like, how do I copy this? I copy this? No, okay. Well, well, fine. So what we'll do is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Matthias is leaving. Okie dokie. One, two, three, four. Okay, good. And then we have. You're very welcome. And we'll have one, two, three, four. And then we'll have another wall. One, two, three, four. We'll just kind of mirror what we have there, here, right? And then we'll have you know the cells. Are these going the right way? They're slightly different, aren't they? Hmm. 
We can't have that. That's going to bug the hell out of me, isn't it? That will bug the hell out of me. Okay, so instead we'll have it like this. Except it's only three. There we go. Oh, uh, yeah. Here we go. Which means this building is slightly too wide already. Oh, man. I've already goofed this up, haven't I? It's like one... Six in the middle there, and it's only four in the middle there. Okay, fine. We'll just get rid of all this, and we'll go... There. And the building can be that size instead. There. That way it's the same as next door. Three, four. Perfect. So that'll be the same as next door. We'll have that. And then what we'll do is we'll... Um, same thing. Uh, just like this. What's up? Go. Too big room. Three, four, oops, five, six. There we go. That'll be good. So now we'll have like the minimum security cell block with um. Oh, B type. Yeah, they should be there very soon. Um. I guess they're they're not going that far. I was just like already. Well, they went to. Fort McMurray. I have the I have the tracking number. I didn't send it to you. I apologize. It's in my car. That looks good. And then what we'll do is we'll have the shower here. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Forget that. More jail cells, just like that. And then they'll have the entrance there. So we'll have a bunch of jail cells like this. We'll have the entrance here. So we'll have that like a big grand old entrance with a double you know jail door to get in and out. Or a single jail door to get in and out. Or like two single jail doors to get in and out of there. And then we'll do the same thing here. You know, we'll have like that. And then like that. That'll be good. And then what we'll do is we'll set up uh, two shower rooms. We'll have one here. And we'll have one down here. That way, these guys can decide, hey, I want to shower up here. I can shower up here. I want to shower down there. I can shower down there. Or, instead of that, rather than doing it that way, right? So, What's up? B-Type said that um, he thinks it's already there. And he said, which also means that he'll be reading my essay. But unfortunately, you sent the... I sent them before the essay. Before Uh-huh. For free. Why don't I believe you? My hotel for using stamps, because it'll fit in the letter package. <laughs> okay, so we'll have two showers, like that and that. That way they can run out, go outside. Mm, maybe not. Maybe we won't have them running outside. I don't know how the hell we're going to do the showers, actually. How the hell should we do the showers? What do you guys think? Maybe that's not the greatest idea for showers. Hmm. How's this shower room? See, this isn't good enough either. We're going to have to, like, do something about this shower room. That guy really wants alcohol. That's too bad, Dennington. You don't get any alcohol. Uh, hmm. How many prisoners? I have 52 right now. Do you have the follower thing? Oh, I have 52 of 64. 52 people in my prison. Um. Surprise! But oh my God, it's Andrew versus Andrew. 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 Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Nameless Empire. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. Oh, there it updated. Yay! Hopefully, I'm not too boring. Pardon me about my webcam today. I'll probably try and fix that for tomorrow or the next day. Oh no, we're not gonna be on tomorrow. Um, so it'll be for Friday. Uh, yeah, I apologize about that. Oh, well, welcome from Australia. Okay, so we're going to build that big-ass building. Um, that's going to be good. How are we doing for your... Oh, shit. 
I don't know how. Okay, so we're gonna build five capacitors. That'll be fine. There we go. We added five more capacitors. Uh, these guys are building probably the biggest building ever. Uh, we're gonna have to figure out how to make. Um, why are we? You ate all of them! It was very tiny to begin with. <laughs> oh, they're installing the capacitors. I was like, what is that noise? There we go. Capacitors for what? For power. Oh. For the power. Okay, so we still haven't figured out the shower situation. I got an idea for the shower situation. Okay, look at this. Right, if we just plan it out. Uh, not very often. Oh, that's not good. I was gonna say, just put like a shower room in the middle. So is this like your third, time, time? third time. Third time playing this. Ever. Ever and ever and ever. What are you guys doing? Foundation education. Foundation education. Look at this. We got two classes of foundation educations. These guys are building a new building. We still haven't figured out a place to put the stupid showers. Um, which sucks. Where should I put the showers? I can't put it there. I've already put the canteen there, which I'm going to put a hallway into. Like, right here. And that way they can get out into the canteen from there. Um, so what we'll do is we'll put a large jail door. Oh, what did I do? Okay, good. I didn't screw it up that and then we'll have a jail door here and here just so that if we ever have to lock down the jail right we won't have huge amounts of issues did is the is it not finished oh no it's not okay how about now no okay open open and open somebody had a spoon who had a spoon? Kemp. David Kemp. You you guys have been so, you know, so good as of late. But now look. Look, you're not good. You're, you're jerks. Okay. And then what we'll do is we'll have like an extension over to here. Oh, okay, great. Uh, huh. Why isn't this building? I don't know why this isn't building yet. Did I mess something up? Oh, there we go. Bam. OMG, Andrew says, I have only just started this game. Have you got any good tips? Like, how many, how many I should take at once? Uh, any advice? Yeah, I don't know. I'm just winging it. I gotta be honest. Um, I don't know if I'm doing it properly or not. But I think kind of this layout that I'm doing here is probably the best. We're gonna have them... Kind of in the middle with the, 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 like a common room in the middle for the minimum security guys. And then the medium security guys will have a common room. And the maximum security guys just have their own little corner that they're not allowed to leave. I think that that is probably a good idea. I'm not too sure though. I'd love to say that I, I'm more of a help, but I'm not. Um, I wish I wish I was more of a help. I'm just sort of, I'm just sort of going with the flow and nobody's really told me that I'm doing things wrong and I've only had like three people die in my jail. So I think, I think the track record of just three people dying is pretty good. Don't you Amanda? Yeah. Okay, that's good. So yeah, only having three people dying is, is pretty good. It's pretty good track record. Oh, and I did get some tips. Um, don't put big pipes to the toilets because they'll like tunnel through them and then get out of your jail. Don't do that. Uh, I heard some horror stories about that. We have to install some electrical cable. And then... I think I gotta replace those. There we go. And we're gonna pull... No, no, not like that. Like this. And yeah, don't pull big pipes to the toilets. Only pull little pipes so that they can't tunnel through them and fit. 
I did learn about that, possibly the hard way. No, nobody's tried to tunnel out yet. I haven't lost an inmate quite yet, which is good news for, for me because that could have been really bad news if they had actually figured out how to tunnel out of my jail. So that's about all I can think of. I don't know much more about the layouts, what they should be or what they shouldn't be, but I know you probably should try and keep the prisoners segregated apart from each other. Uh, dog patrols in common areas are a good idea. I found because then they can sniff out people like Johnson or Jackson here that has cigarettes and uh, everything seems to be pretty happy only one person is seriously pissed off about my jail so that's good but I still need to figure out where I'm gonna put a shower um, that's a problem I'm probably gonna let these guys finish this up we're gonna plan out where I'm gonna put a shower I'm trying to at least if I do like this I think this might be okay for a shower look like that with a door there or not a door there we'll put a door there that'll be fine one two three four five six seven shower heads no one two three four five six seven eight nine i have nine shower heads right now well one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen shower heads maybe we're gonna have to just do two like like this and then that way We'll have two showers kind of bifurcating away the uh no i don't like that i don't like that uh where are we gonna put we just need to just get a really big shower room we'll just put it over here for these guys or for all the guys yeah let's just do that forget it we're just gonna put a big shower room big concrete shower room like like look it's gonna be a big sob pardon on the open count the beds <laughs> okay so there we'll just make a giant shower room for them and then what we'll do is here we'll open this up with a jail door so that they can walk through here to here we'll get another fence put it in there so this would be a big giant shower for both of them we're going to ditch the shower room and have it open to the, um, the yard that's going to be here that we're going to put in. It's like that. It's all going to be grass. So these, these workers are going to be pretty busy bees for the next little while. They still haven't managed to get power into the new jail, into the new wing. Uh, I don't think anyone has actually passed the foundation education program. Let's find out. Um, programs. Nobody's passed. That's good. Behavioral therapy, nobody's passed that either. Um, oops. Uh, pharmacological treatment of drug addiction. 19 people have passed, actually. That's good. Group par alcoholic group therapy, one person has passed. That's good. Um, there's lots of parole hearings for tomorrow. That's all right. We got 24 people out on parole. That's excellent. Okay. Let's see how many prisoners we can do. Uh, we can get four more minimum or medium security. Let's do that. We'll get four more medium security guys in for tomorrow. Uh, intake. Medium security. One, two, three, four. We don't want maximum. There we go. So we'll just get four more medium security guys in tomorrow just to fill up the empty beds that are here. I think once these guys finish beavering away over here, which it, it will be happening fairly soon, I think. Uh, these guys have built that, so that's good. What we'll do is we're just going to have regular doors. Uh, rooms, doors. Doors, doors. Door. We'll have, like, a couple regular doors kind of in here, right, into the big shower room, and we'll just have them locked open. So that'll be a big old shower room. This will be like a nice big walkway between the two. Thank you for the follow, Dominator. Welcome to the Name of Empire on Twitch. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. It's always fun to have new people or more people hanging out with us. So thank you for hitting that button. It's great. It is awesome. Muchly appreciate it. Um, thank you for for taking time out of your evening and hanging out with 
us here it, it does mean quite a lot thank you thank you thank you thank you in my most humblest thank yous i say that there this is all gonna be paving stone so we've given our our guys mucho de stuff to do here um but it's good look now we can install we can tell them that this is a new yard for the minimum security sons of guns right it's gonna be a big giant yard for them we're gonna put some phone boost in we're gonna put a shitter in it's gonna be great i mean these guys really can't have any problems with this place we've get we're getting lights installed oh this is so good these guys haven't quite finished this building yet, but it's all good. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Minimum security is going to be pretty pimping. I think we're going to need some more... Um, somebody in here? Oh. Are we only have three qualified guys to work there, so... I think we're going to need a new laundry. I think that's, uh, I think that's a thing. Room quality. They have a window. So all of these are like really shitty rooms. Occupant entitled to grade six. Grade two is average. These guys are grade ones. That's too bad. I really don't care. Some labor, food distribution. It's pretty good. Supply 18, demand. Okay. Yeah, this is good. Apparently we got some people in the holding cell. Uh, What happened? Why are there people in the holding cell? I don't know. All good though. That's too bad. Okay, so. Oh, this is all finished up. That's excellent news. Um, so we'll do this. Is this finished up? It's almost finished up. Oh no, it is. Great. It just looks a little wonky for some reason. I don't know why it looks wonky, but it does. Uh, so we'll get some power into this room. Kind of like that. Maybe like that. That'll be good. So we're getting some some decent money right now uh we're gonna have to close off this wall and actually change this to brick i may or may not have goofed oops here we go i may or may not have goofed uh the canteen might be too small now so we'll have to extend it out to fit this to fit more people in because we're gonna get a bunch of you know normal security mm. What are you guys talking about? Because we type, had mentioned a sub about um, he, asked, he told me or us about his 24 month internship at Edge where he's an undercover as a brutal military Oh, that's cool. Look at that. We got 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. 40 shower heads in here. Bam! If 40 men can't have a shower together in my prison, I don't know what what's going to be awesome. I think 40 men having showers together is a great idea, to be honest with you. Yep, there we go. What are you doing out here? What the shit? No, 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 no. Why are you guys out there? Did I tell you you could go out there? No, I didn't. So now, we're going to do this, and we're going to put a staff door right there, and you can't get over there. Like, straight up. That's happening. Just, you idiots, don't go out there. And now, we'll... Set this up. Great. Okay. Excellent. So now we're making the brand new showers here. Uh, we'll lock that open so they don't have to keep going through there. That's great. Okay. Um, prison labor. Nope. Deployment. So this here is staff only. Straight up, you can't go there. If you're not staff, you can't go there. Prisoners, that's too bad. Okay. 
So now they can't go like meandering around in that area without a guard that'll let them in. So that's good. Look at this guy. What the fuck? Benjamin, get the hell out of there. Go back to your cell. Dum dum. Okay, so we'll do that. Uh, this guy should hook up all the shower stuff. So hopefully by tomorrow we'll have a new shower all like uh, ready to rock and roll. We haven't built one of everything yet. So we're going to try and build one of everything. And then we'll probably call it there on this prison. What am I looking for? Shower. Shower. Bam. Okay, so that's going to be a new shower. If they ever, you know, come to pipe it up. Here we go. This workman is coming to pipe it up. That's good. I don't know what all the workmen are doing. They really should be doing something else. Like, oh, I don't know. Building my shower stalls. Come on now. There you go. Yeah, that's right. Put in the shower heads, build the shower stalls so that all of these crims can have a nice shower tomorrow. So they have free time right now, which means we're going to abolish the shower room. How do I get rid of the shower room? Just like, like that. Okay, good. And then what we'll do is we'll clear that. Just get rid of all that. And then what we're going to do is get a couple uh, doors. Door. Door. Here we go. And that will hook this up to the new yard. For people and stuff. That'll be good. Okay. That makes me happy. So now we have like the canteen that is going to hook up this giant jail cell uh, into... I don't know. Are we even making license plates? How do I even make them make license plates? Does anybody know? Do I have to tell them to make license plates? Emergencies, utilities, like... Make license plates. No. Oh, we got room for five more low risk guys, don't we? Policy, regime, finance. We exported some stuff. That's cool. Policy needs jobs. Jobs. Operate workshop saw. Okay, well, we'll see if they actually make license plates. I doubt they will. I think we need more people uh, to work here. Like, um,. Logistics. We only have three qualified people. Workshop safety. Uh, programs. Workshop safety. Four passed. Oh, look at that. That's great. Okay. This is good. So, everything's working out. Uh, we're going to do the same thing that we did before. So, we're going to get... They're just kind of taking all this stuff apart. Oh, they're just demolishing that, of course. Uh, open. I don't want to sack the workman. I just want to open the door. There we go. So now we have, like, the means to get in and out of the new yard. Uh, what we'll do is we'll have some really nice pathways between the two so that people can you know, go really fast between the two. So that'll be good. Um, Young really needed a pee, but he didn't quite make it due to the simple fact that he is being searched right now. Uh, he had a cell phone and that um, that was really stupid of him to be honest but you know what can you do what can you do I mean prisoners will be prisoners thus being stupid all the time so put a put a bin down there put a bin down there did we put a bin close here no we didn't so we'll put a bin there too and then um we we'll got a couple lights for out here, like what one, two, three, and four, so that way there's some lights outside. And then we'll get, you know, some some iron, so people can pump up, and then we'll put, you know, some. Look at that there. Now they can call home. That's great. Okay, so our yard is looking pretty good. Our like yard 2.0 is looking really quite nice. Uh, we're gonna have to get some more, um, what's it called? Cell phone, put it in the hole. There we go. So we'll get some more metal detectors in. That way, you know, oh, we're spending qu quite a bit of money here. Now we'll, 
We'll start hooking up the new beds. Oh shit. I think I goofed up, didn't I? The poopers are supposed to be there, so we'll put the beds here. That's how we have it anyway. Oops. Alright, nine, ten. So now we're just installing all the beds so we can get a bunch more prisoners. We're gonna have to expand the canteen though, because um we're just gonna have to. Uh, we're gonna have way too many people in the canteen to uh, be able to deal with the sheer amounts of people coming through so it will do that okay so we're getting the toilets and stuff we're gonna have to hook up some electrical cables we'll just do it like that that should be fine I think that hooks up like that so the guys are coming in with the beds putting them all inside the, the jail cells and what we'll do I think for these, you know, minimum security guys, we'll give them some some nice luxuries, like room quality. It's like, oh, a TV, a radio, a bookshelf, or a chair, hmm, an outdoor window. So what, you have to give them, like, hotel rooms, pretty much? I think that's bullshit. They don't deserve hotel rooms, they're in jail. I don't think they deserve hotel rooms. But we can make some like super squishy, you just stole a little bit of money. Um, jails? Jail cells? We could do that. I don't know. Probably not a good idea. But look, they're beavering away. The new shower has been installed. So that's good. Um, like we'll, we'll kind of put a guard there. What the hell? That's crazy talk can't believe that so we're gonna get a guard patrolling the new giant shower I think that's probably a good idea um, we're gonna lock these doors open right and then that way there's nothing that they can do they possibly cannot get into much too much doo-doo uh, if they just do that okay so this is looking good I think I think I think everything is good so far so far so good so far so bad uh, we can get a few more people in um, to minimum sec. I think I always get this wrong. Deployment? Oh, here we go. Minimum security only is there. That's minimum security. That's minimum security. That's minimum security. So all of this is just minimum security only. This here is, I mean, theoretically, it's kind of, it's mixed. I think. Yeah. I mean, there's not much I can do about that right now. That's medium security only. This will be medium security only. Also, medium security showers. Uh, so that's that. Great. Okay. So now we know. Like, they know where they need to go. We're going to have to redo the showers a little bit. We're going to make a new, uh, like, laundry and stuff for the minimum security guys. Maybe we'll kind of fill up this area. Okay, so that doesn't work, apparently. Uh, they're literally just flooding everything uh, here. Um, so that kind of sucks. We'll have to uh, deploy some more drains or something. We've literally flooded the entire um, the entire prison has been flooded by the showers. So that'll be that'll be fine. That's fine. It's fine. Nobody's uh, paying attention. Uh -huh. And I tried to play it like I was driving normally. So I went off on a tangent about that. And then he said, once he spent 15 minutes trying to parallel the park walls and not completely <laughs> I remember trying to play GTA like the proper way. Quote, equal proper, proper GTA. All right. Everything's looking good. The shower is showered. Everybody's happy. Um... Excellent. Did you tweet? Don't hit me. What the fuck? You have one job. Don't no, it's too late now. You've totally ruined that, Amanda. I can't believe it. What did you post, huh? I did a screenshot of how many 
many followers we have on YouTube. Yay. Okay. This is looking good. I'm really happy about this, actually. Uh, now, what we can do is we're going to assign another room, a uh, common room, to the middle here, like we have before. That'll be a nice common room. Look, we'll even extend it into this area, too. Like, this will all be common room. Look at that. Great. So that's all. Excuse me. It's all common room. What are these guys doing? Oh, he's he's teaching the Alcoholics Anonymous. That's good of him. These guys here are just making wood into panels. They're not actually. Oh, they're te the, the foreman is teaching them. Oh, that's great. That's great. Maybe the wood shop has to, or the workshop has to be bigger. What's this guy doing? Move wood to exports. Oh, that's excellent. Okay, so look at this, and then we'll have to. Um, I'm really, I'm really quite happy about this. So what we'll do is we'll get another couple. We'll get like a CCTV monitor, like there, and one. Is this facing the right way? Yeah, from there and there. That way we'll be able to monitor uh, a lot of our jail with, with closed camera, closed circuit television cameras. That'll be good. Okay. Yes. Uh, we don't want any more normal security people at this Oh shoot, I'm overflowing with normal risk offenders. So hopefully, oh, one guy's just got released. So that's good. Uh, that's really good. Oh shit, somebody, garden shears. Who's this? Dennington, he's a new guy. Oh, you dumbass. Look at this. He's going to the, he's going to the, uh. Uh, looks like we're gonna need another more, a couple more guards. We got more guards. Jeez, this jail is getting, it's getting pretty big. And we need a big regime ooh, of guards and whatnot. All right, so we're going to hook up um, somebody, somebody. Okay, so what are we doing? Young is just chilling out. All right, so let's connect this. Not the light. Tab. CCTV. We're going to connect it. How many connections does this thing have? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It can take one more. Can it? I think so. Well, I've done something wrong. I feel like this one here. You have to connect it the other way. I don't remember. How many connections? One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Uh, eight. Oh yeah, you have to connect it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You clear connections. You, you, clear connections. So this here, if I connect it to there, how many connections does it have now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Great. And if I connect it to you, perfect. Now everything's connected. We have some vision inside our jail cells, inside our cell block. That's good. Dale is just addicted to cocaine and just chilling out inside the uh the yard that's nice okay great i'm thinking well that common room has to be common room for everyone that's fine uh mosaic floor for here that'd be nice we'll mosaic floor all of this up we will wooden floor all of this up like i said this is going to be really nice squishy like you stole some money jail right there. 
It looks really good, too. I mean, we're spending all of our money on these guys. I don't think we should, but we are. And then we'll install the jail doors. Look at that. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Get 22 more jails. Like, 22 more crims in here. Look at this. This is going to be great. Okay. Wow. Um, oh my god. Who who stole a knife? This is true. Benjamin Conigan. Um He's going he's going into the solitary confinement because he had a knife. Stupid man. Everything seems to be fine in the jail right now. Um Workman. Open. We'll just kinda open all of these doors right now. Open. Oops. Open. Open. Why did I do this right now? I should have done this at the very last. So that the workmen don't get stuck inside the jail cells. But, you know, it's fine. Look, all's well that ends well. Great. Um, I may or may not have... Got rid of some of my mosaic floor here. There we go. We'll fill that in. We can close this now. Normal. 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 Can I select a whole bunch? No. Normal. 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 And normal. Great. So, it looks like we can get many, many more crims in the jail. Um, at least 22, I think, more. We have room for... It says we have room for 20. Oh, maximum safe capacity is 64. B-Type says this movie is about the 80s taught me something. It's that this jail is missing a brutal underground bare knuckle boxing ring with oil that pins the place. Also, the story is from Alexa. Yeah. This is like... A really nice prison. Here we go. Here we go. Now we're talking. Oh, I may have goofed that up too. I think I did a mosaic floor for here. Not hardwood floor. What are you doing? Alright, so. Now, what we'll do. Um... Do we have a guard patrol here? No, we don't. I think I'm gonna get another, like, couple of dogs. Uh, kennel? No? What is this? Dog crate. Oh, of course. Dog crate. And a couple dog crates. And then we'll hire a couple more uh, dog handlers. And what we'll do is we'll have a a dog patrol? Where's the patrol? Oh, dang it. Deployment. Dog patrols. And we'll have... You know... Bookshelves to the prisoners? I can do that. Why doesn't that work? There we go. So we'll get a dog patrol for there. Great. So now we have a patrol that'll happen all the time. That's great. We'll give we'll give them bookshelves then. Bookshelves in the cells. These cells are going to be fairly crowded, but it's fine. Look, these guys here. Oops. There we go. We're putting them right the right ways now. Look at that. These guys will have bookshelves in their in their hotel rooms here. I mean, they're really small hotel rooms, but uh, it's fine. Look, even these guys are going to get upgraded to bookshelves in their hotel rooms. That makes me feel like I've done my, my inmates, you know, 
I've done them good. There we go. So now they'll have bookshelves in their rooms. We're going to get them a nice couple of more pool tables. We'll put one, you know, like here. Put one up here. We'll have a couple, you know, sofas here and here and maybe here and here. Or, which way are they facing? That way. Okay, good. A couple TVs. Kind of, kind of facing the way the... Who knows? I don't care. Great. Excellent. They don't get TVs. They don't get TVs. The TVs are in the common rooms. Yeah. They're not gonna get TVs in the cells. They're I, I don't I don't mind like having them them having a bookshelf or so in the cells, but like a TV now that's that's going a little crazy. So apparently having uh, the drains there they don't it still doesn't work. So we're gonna have to place more drains there. I think that that might help quite possibly. And what we'll do is we'll have this ceramic floor in here. I'm just spending all my money. I mean, we're not doing anything. Um, oh, we have one more thing that we can do, I think, in the... Uh, what's it? Grants? Cell block C? Raise your prisoner capacity to 100. Oh, I'm at 86. Maybe we'll make another cell block for... Um, like another dormitory for medium security guys and then we'll get a hundred Mason wants to know where's bubbly at Bubby 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 so minimum security is 18 minimum security 13 so we can get I mean 30 so we get 13 17 more we get 17 more minimum security guys do you think we're ready for 17 more minimum security guys? No. Are we going to do it anyway? You bet your damn mind Bubba. we are. Bubba. Bubba? All right. We're going to have to make the canteen bigger here. But that's okay. Uh, I think that'll be it'll be totally fine if we make the canteen a lot bigger. And that way we can fit 17 more guys in the canteen. So that'll be good. We have... Okay. Everything's everything's pretty good. Uh, put some grass here, here. Spending all of our money. Oh, but we are making some good money, so it's fine. Making seven hundred and eighty bucks a day. I don't know who Bubba is. I see that. Okay, here we go. It looks like our danger level is low and increasing. Uh, they don't like it that armed guards are in service. That's too bad. Listen, if I have to, you know, kind of lay the law down once in a while in the jail, uh, it, it happens, yo. I have to move my workshop? Is it in the wrong spot? I don't, I don't think it's in the wrong spot. It's all connected, sort of. Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll end up moving it. I think we're going to come out this way, too. Come out this way with another um, cell block. Uh, first things first, though, we need to build a massive fence around the entire thing. Just so that the prisoners won't run off. Just kind of like so. Oh my goodness, somebody had drugs. Who had drugs? I don't know. Whoever it is, is now in solitary confinement. You, idiot. Ed. Bizwix. Stupid. What did it say? His. What? What's. Cell quality is below average. Ah, that's too bad. I don't know how to put windows in here. Like, what? I can put a window out to. I wonder if that'll work. They won't do what? They will. They will run away. I'm I'm still gonna put a fence because you know what? I'm scared anyway, so Who had a fork? Oh my goodness, look at this. Jesus. This guy again! Benjamin Conigan. What's with you in garden shears and trying to be like a horrible man? Like really, these guys are watching TV. I wonder It's recreation and comfort, okay. 
That's fine. What do they need by literacy? I'm trying to get a library, but nobody's smart enough to work in said library. So. Oh. Oh, cool. There we go. That's true. I mean, these guys have it nice in here now. Let's see. Room quality. It's grade three. It's average. Occupant entitled to grade three. So this occupant is entitled to grade 10. That's too bad. What's wrong with this? Oh, it doesn't have a window. We got to give him a window. Window. There we go. I can have a window now. Great. So I wonder if putting that window there actually made this cell any better. No. Outdoor window. It doesn't have that. It doesn't have any of this stuff. This guy's got a window. This guy's like a real fancy son of a gun right there. Okay. Great. Everything is everything's pretty good. This guy here, he's just chilling. What we're going to do is we're going to put a toilet outside. I feel that that's a, a, a necessity in the yards to have a toilet outside. Okay. So we'll put a toilet outside. We'll give the guys a little privacy by putting a couple brick walls around it. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. Great. Excellent. Well. I think it's going pretty good. Um. Everything's moving fairly, fairly nicely. We have 17 prisoners coming. Hi, Lizzy. Good evening. Um, so let's start. These guys build the fence yet? They're, they're almost done building the fence. So what we'll do is now we will plan out. Um, so none of these guys are going to get outdoor windows. And that, quite frankly, is too bad. But what we'll do, okay. I will give them some bookshelves inside their rooms. I think... At least we'll give them a bookshelf because I mean look how nice this place is nice bookshelf and stuff so I'll be good look this guy's name is Q Dan Scatman Q the co oh fuck this guy had a drill who had a drill James Davies dude James Davies you dumb dumb can't believe you do that Unbelievable. Okay. Um, all these guys. I mean, look how nice this is. What has he got? Oh, shit. We're going to search this guy. I noticed he had drugs on his name. Expand it? Okay. Well, he needs drugs. I'm not giving him any drugs. Okay, so we'll expand up the workshop. We'll make it so that we can get way more work happening in said workshop. That'll be good. Oh my god, who had a shiv? Somebody brought a shiv into the kitchen. That's incredible. Um, oh, good. This is expanded, so what we'll do... So we're going to uh, expand the room bigger. Because we're going to get way more people in here, uh, it looks like the canteen is going to need to expand quite a little bit larger. And we're going to have to get another table. Oh, that table is just gone. I don't know why that table is gone. We'll get another table. Uh, I guess here, maybe. We'll put another table along here. Actually, no. We'll put another table there. Put another table there, and we'll put another table like there. And we'll put another some party benches in, just so that these guys can have a fun old time, just like so. Perfect. Okay, so that'll expand the canteen out. Have you ever been on a mechanical bull? No. Have you? No. I think that would be entertaining as hell, to be honest. I think I tried at one point once. Uh huh. Okay, sleeping. Oh, did somebody get out in maximum security? Oh shoot, somebody got out. Oh, very nice, very nice. All right, that's great. Everything's everything's pretty good. Okay, so we're gonna fill up all of these new cells tomorrow. 
Um, Surprise! We're gonna expand the workshop. Curse that! Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Nameless Empire. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. It's always fun to have you guys hanging out with me. I I'm glad that you guys took time out of your new busy school schedules. Okay, hold on. How big are these things? To hang out with us. Um, it does mean a lot. One, two, three. Okay, so they're three by three. You think so? I'm thinking about just making the workshop really big. Like, look, if I do this, make the workshop big. And then I can go down. I think I want to go down, though. And that way, they all funnel to the, the central hallway. Here. I think I'm going to go down instead. And we'll make the workshop really big. And then that way, we'll have an entrance into here and into here. And then we can start kind of segregating the ranks out a little bit. So, oh, of course, I got rid of everything I did. Three, 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 three. We'll have like that many more table. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna make the workshop slightly bigger. Let's just do it. Bam. Okay, so we're gonna expand the workshop just to make it bigger there. And then we'll have an entrance into here. That'll be good. And then what we'll try to do is we'll try and start kind of segregating out all of the different ranks. So I mean, we'll have a classroom for minimum security. We'll have a classroom for maximum security and then medium security. We'll have a shop for like medium security and, and minimum security, that type of thing. I think that'll be fine. And that way we'll make some extra money with prison work. That'll be good too. Okay, so we're gonna get our 17 guys coming in uh, pretty quick. Oh, I put the wrong tile up here. I feel that I've wasted a lot of money doing this. What kind of floor is that? Is it ceramic floor? Fancy tiles, oh, I put fancy, t I put fancy tiles in. Well, that was a $650 mistake, but it's okay. We made $200 back by exporting crap, so that's fine. We got our toilet here. This guy's got a view right into the shitter from his jail cell. That's nice. Um, here we go. So we got the builders, Bob the Builders, coming in. Okay. And these guys are going for their shower. See, we have to give them two hours now for the shower because they have to walk quite a way to get to the showers. <coughs> but that's all good. Look at that. Here we go. Yes. What, what did you... You don't want a shower? Oh, he's got to go to the... Yeah. Thank you. And we'll come. Come to Vancouver. I hear that there's a mechanical bull at Roxy. Is it Roxy or is it Gabby's? Where they do the topless one. Roosters. Yeah. Cabby's isn't big enough for mechanics. <laughs> I don't know. I've never been to any of them. So I'm just like talking out my ass, to be honest with you. Uh, great. So we're going to expand the workshop and then we're going to expand down. So what we'll do is we're going to plan it out so that we'll have like a second kind of walkway. I think I've done this wrong. Okay. So expand it out so that the walkway is going to be too wide right something like this and then we'll have um something the same because i don't want the prisoners oops i don't want the prisoners being able to uh get out that's the thing so if we kind of do it uh so that's going to be the walkway one two three like that okay so There we go. Did I do that right? No, that's not the same as the other way. We're going to have to do it the other way. Just to be like the OCD and everybody, which will be like, oh my God, monkey, you did it the wrong way. So I'll do it the other way like this. And then that way, everything will be a-okay. Great. And then we'll have like that. We'll have two... And we'll have it sort of like this. Oops. Just laying it like that. So if we do this, I think that might be... I think that'll be okay. It's not exactly the same as what we had, but I think that this will be fine. What do you guys think? And then we'll have like the nice walkway in the middle. I don't... 
Oh, because see. Because, look, I'm sure between a mechanic and a welder, we can build a mechanical bowl. You got a good point. We can make a four-cylinder mechanical bowl. 100 horsepower mechanical bowl. Why would you want to do that? Why not? You'll have a stick shift on it, too. You'll to? No, to change gears to make it go faster. <laughs> not to hold on to, silly goose. I don't think my landlord would like it if I had a mechanical bull in my backyard. And my backyard's not big enough for a mechanical bull, to be honest. There we go. Okay. Okay, so I think... I did want to do it this way. I was told early on in my prison architect career not to make the jail cells on the outside. Because... Prisoners will escape or something. So I think I wanted to do it like this on purpose. There. Uh, oh shit. Yeah. Okay. There. Here we go. I think I've planned it out <laughs> fairly well. So now you know what yours and Lids is, uh, what's the word will be? Um, okay, that'll be enough prisoners for now. The canteen's not going to be big enough, so we're going to have to expand it all into here, but that'll be fine. Okay, good. So now we have this. Uh, I think that'll be pretty good. We're going to have to get a new, like, electrical area um, because, well... I don't think we're going to have enough power for all of this soon. We're going to have to get a new, yeah, electrical shed for most of this. Did we get our prisoners? I think we did. We'll turn those guys off. Are all 62 of 86? Did we get our prisoners? 42? No, we didn't. Oops. Intake. Uh, 17. Oops. 42 minimum. I was at 42 minimum. 28. 28, 38. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, not 17. 14. 14, not 17. There we go. And that way, they'll all be able to just hang around. Why are you guys in there? This should only be sort of medium security, guys, but that's fine. Okay. There we go. So we're going to expand upon. How much money do we have? Not much anymore. I think we need to start building this before we start um, with uh, anything else. So we're going to... Oh, shit. I think I might have goofed up. Can I just... Okay, good. God, that was almost terrible. Okay, so we'll do that. Great. So build away, my pretties. It looks like it's eating time. And all the prisoners are, are going and they're going to be happy in um, here. Is that? I don't even know. Is Are all of these taken? Not too sure, actually. One, two, three, four. I guess so. It says... 42 minimum capacity. And we have 28. Well, we're going to get 14 more. We'll see what happens. All right. That'll be good. So these guys are now building the probably like a massive, the biggest building ever. That's great. Really? That's oh, it's good. It's a lot of fun, actually. I'm... Pork? Yeah, yeah. Workshop press. Okay, here we go. Oh, somebody had a cell phone. Bob Poodle Dole, you had a cell phone and now you're screwed. Wait. How many more people are there, really? Uh, hold the phone. Just wait. We have room for one, two, three, four, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen. Four, th we're gonna get thirteen. <laughs> 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I think we had room for 14, but we're going to go with 13. I have lag? Oh. Oh, I see that. It usually happens at about this time. And look, my green screen's broke, too. Uh, yet again. Lunch problems. No. My shit internet problems. There we go. Okay, cool. We dropped 374 frames. 0.17 of the of the of the stream has been broken. Ooh. I don't know. It seems to be working. Did Twitch give us the source button? Is that why it's all busted? That might be it. When Twitch gives me a source button and it does this, it really pisses me off. Because everybody leaves because they think I've gone offline. <sighs> of course. Sorry. Or is this not working either? No, it is. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. So, everything seems to be working. The workmen are still slowly but surely putting everything into the workshop. So that's good. Um, I thought there was a guard deployed to there. There should be at least. Guard deployed to there. Good. So now we'll be able to have many people here. Hi, Purdy. Thanks for hanging out with us. Shelly's deployment logistics, prison labor. Why why doesn't my workshop actually work as prison labor? I think lots of people have been playing Metal Gear Solid. Utilities? No. Logistics. Why isn't my workshop like working? Minimum size, five by five. We made a big workshop. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so now what we can do is we're going to build, we're gonna demolish this wall all the way to here, right? We're gonna install this wall all the way to here. Right, and then that way. Are we back at all on Twitch or no? We might have to refresh. Cause it's uh, I don't know. Did we? Okay, so we're building that up. Build this up. We got more people coming in. Holy cow! We're spending all our money. We only got $300 left or $3,000 left, which is not very good. Um, and a lot of this place is being plunged into darkness, which also is not good. So we'll have to kind of like bring some wire down and around. Bring it like that and like that. We're spending all of our money right now. Okay. So all these guys are going to run over and have a shower. What's up? I was just checking to see if I missed anything. My chat didn't actually I don't, I don't think you did. Um, which is like broken. Updated. Yeah. But it should be working for people. I hope so. We're not dropping any frames anymore. <laughs> yeah, we did get a source button. Hooray. Source button. Breaks everything. Stupid source button. Okay, so we'll put a brick wall there. Great. All right, so we're making... Uh, 
uh, making this. We're gonna get rid of um, that door. Just dismantle that door. Because we don't need it. We're gonna have to put a wall in there. That'll be fine. Um, the workshop. Now, as far as the workshop goes. Great. Now the workshop is massive. And we can have many prisoners in it working. So, that'll be good. Uh, this is in plunged into darkness. We're going to have to make the canteen bigger. Which means we're going to have to, you know, like, destroy the laundry room and the shower. But that'll be fine. So, we'll make the canteen a lot bigger. Um, to make those guys happy. These guys are pretty happy. Uh, we don't need to have any of these guys in here. Alright, so we're getting our new load of prisoners. Look at them come. Hooray. Well, alright. You don't have a koala tea button? No, I guess not. We're not we're not cool enough for a koala tea button today. That's fine though. Okay, so the new guys are coming in. Uh, they're getting assigned to their jail cells. Look at this. This, this guy here, right away... This new guy, sentenced seven years for blackmail, he plead not guilty. He's got some, like, he's got something on him, and he's being searched right away. We got Mike Rowe right here. No, it's Adam Rowe, actually. He, uh, he pirated indie video games, and he plead not guilty. He got eight years. Oh, my God, this guy brought a hammer into... Oh, wow. He's going to solitary. This guy here, over here, has a hammer, too. Unbelievable. Jeez Louise, all these guys are such badasses with hammers and shit. Can't believe it. Okay. So these guys here are going to be doing some work in the shop. They're going to be cutting some woods. Hopefully they don't cut their arms off and stuff. Um, it could happen. They're all operating workshop saws, so it very well definitely could happen. Um, I don't know why none of them have, any, have made any license plates yet. I don't know how to actually do it. Stop it. Increase your prison profitability. Well, to your best funds to help workshops and turn your prisoners into a labor force. Oh, well, shit. They're making them. License plates. Yes. We've made license plates. Mafu, thank you. Thank you, Al Alpine Mafu. His name is Matthew Robertson, actually. But thank you, man. I'd be really big with the speckly background. <laughs> well, great. We've actually done some, made some progress here. We've actually made some license plates, which is good. Um, it's really good. This guy here, what happened? I think he overdosed. This guy, somebody stole. Oh my gosh. You, Felix Griffin, you tried to, you know, pull a fast one and steal steal a saw out of um, the the workshop, and that's not good. That's not so good. You're not supposed to do that. Alright, so they're cooking up a bunch of meals. Hopefully, they'll have enough food to go around. We might need to make another couple of cookers, but we'll see uh, what happens here. It appears that the shower room is completely full of water. No, no, it's fine now. Okay, this is great. Alright, our jail is actually pretty good. Everybody's got free time. They're doing whatever they want to do. They're watching TV. Uh, that was bad. Alright. Uh, 7386 people. Oh, look at that. I know. Medium Wait, capacity is only 14. Where are my medium capacity is only 14? It says normal capacity. Oh, 24. Right. And we have capacity for 14. Oh, weird. I don't know why we only have capacity for 14. I mean, seriously. Everything's fine. We're going to have to make the shower and stuff bigger. So. What I'm going to do, I'm going to expand uh, this room. Uh, okay, we got lots of money now. We're going to expand this room, like, massive. Uh, we're going to put a laundry in over here, too. 
So that these guys in... Oh, what is he doing? What is he doing? Oh, shit. Look at you. You son of a bitch. Okay. Alright. The high... The... the The, uh, the, the maximum security is getting the cell block searched while they're out in the yard. I don't know why. I don't know why. They got a, a... Oh, this guy's got SIGs. I have to remove the tunnels. Like, just kind of look in this whole area, remove the tunnels. All right, well, we searched up the cell block. I think it might be time for a shakedown tonight. It's all good, though. All right, good. Okay, very happy with this. Everything everything seems to be working pretty good. Um, these guys are building a really big new addition to the prison. That's good. All right. Now, I wonder why it says we only have capacity for 14. Is it probably because this is too small? Not too sure. All right. So that has become... Oh, what's happened? Oh, no. Oh, no. Punchy McGee. Oh, shit. He got tased. You got freaking tased. You, Ian. Why you gotta be like that? You dumbass. You fucking tased. He's going to lockdown for two hours and solitary for two hours. Unconscious, of course. And they searched his cell and he had a, and he had a, a cell phone. So what a horrible, horrible man. Golly. Alright, I think our library is actually working out pretty good. It is. That's good. Oh my goodness. He got freaking tased. I really like that. Maybe the doctor. Okay, so now the doctor's gonna go in solitary, right? And he's gonna fix it right up. Right? So there comes the guard and he's gonna get all fixed up. You stupid man. So now he's all fixed up. And now look, you're in solitary. You're been like... Oh. You're just, you're not a smart fellow. Okay, so, um, now that this is all done, we're gonna need to, um, excuse me, make the maximum people go crazy. <laughs> okay, uh, so we're gonna have to change up a little bit here. I'm thinking, plan it out a little bit. So, was this three wide? So we'll go like this, right? We'll have a, a real big shower room. Just kind of like we have over here, right? Just a big shower room. I don't think it has to be that tall. What's happening? What happened? These people are having like big problems nowadays. What are you Gibbs, you stupid man. Gibbs is is a real douche. What is what's going on here? Go to lockdown is security. Oh my goodness. He lit stuff on fire. He broke his bed. Unbelievable. And the doctor's healing him now. This guy's a jerk. And this other guy has come back from solitary for his two hour visit. My goodness, they're all getting like unruly. This is great. Um, okay, so uh, something like this. So we'll have the shower room kind of here, right? So all this will be shower room. We'll all kind of funnel into this like double door we'll put in here. So let's do that right now, actually. Um, so we'll kind of put a big shower room right here. Let's pull some utilities over. So we'll get like get some large pipe, kind of like that, I think. And then what we'll do is we'll put another kind of no I don't want to we'll do that we'll put some large pipe down into there and then what we'll do is we'll continue the small pipe down 
we're getting pretty poor from this, so we're gonna have to. What's up? Uh, nothing. nothing? Okay. Why? Oh, you're fucked. So I don't know exactly what that means. You're but fucked. I think that with the shit that has happened over the past two months with like my other coworkers, I feel like she's gonna be giving me a little bit more responsibility, which kind of sucks. Well, then ask for more but money. I was just saying, in turn, I am going to ask for more money and a higher bonus percentage. Yeah. Based on the shit that I do. Yeah, man. Dismantle all the shower heads. I wish there was a quick way to dismantle things, but there's not. Uh, I realized that none of these guys tomorrow are going to get their shower because the shower doesn't exist anymore. Uh, speaking of which, uh, shower, shower is going to be here, not here. Uh, dismantle, 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 dismantle. Dismantle, 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 and dismantle. And now we'll get uh, sh shower heads. We got 12. Oh, see, none of these guys have actual shower heads to take showers with, which kind of sucks. Um, I do apologize in advance, you guys. Um, there we go. And then what we'll do is we'll get a couple. We'll install some drains. There we go. So now. Hopefully. I mean, maybe before the shower time is out. Yeah, I know. You can't read hygiene. I want to have a shower. Well, sorry. I was a little slow on the old shower department here. Sucks to be you guys. You didn't get a shower today. You can shower later. It'll be fine. Okay. Where's all those guys? Oh, see, they were all in the shower. Look at them all. Oh, dear. Hopefully, there was enough food for all of them. Yeah, there was. That's good. Oh, no, there wasn't. This poor guy didn't get any food. I'm really sorry, man. We need to get some more food happening here. Like, not everyone got food. That's not good. It's not good. We need more cooks. Uh... How do I do this? Deployment? Oh, snap. Here we go. We have 10 cooks. I got three more there. Got another one there. Three more there. Okay, now we're poor. We are literally broke. Oh, look. No, there's food here. Well, there. Somebody had a cell phone? That's crazy. Okay. So, these guys really need to, to start working. Yo, we'll get electrical cable into this room, into this room, this room, there's a tunnel, again, up to here, okay, um, that's not good, they're tunneling out, there's, there's somebody tunneling out of here, look at that, uh, remove tunnels, oh, what are they, I don't even get it. Okay, well, I lock up tonight. We're going to have a shakedown. And um, that'll be that. And we'll have a big shakedown. So what are you doing? Let's just play blank. This guy's being cut up by the work saw currently. See, his, his little like stubby butt is being cut up by the work saw, which is fine. We've produced some license plates. We've produced 10% of... Oh, there they are. Shit, yeah. Nice. He didn't He didn't have a shower today. I'm, I apologize, Chris Danson. Uh, we're building a new shower currently right now. So, apparently all of my worker jollies are pretty tired. And they don't want to um, do any work. Welcome back, Lorantha. That's fair enough. Alright, look. People can have showers in here now. 
So you missed your shower earlier. You can have a shower now. Look. Oh, this guy was naked. He was like, man, I can't wait. He was naked running down the hallways. What? Like, getting a shower. Look, you can see his little nippies. His little He's got them, look. See this guy? Oh, look at his little butt crack. Look at that. These guys have no shame. They just, like, run down the hallway butt naked. Alright, so that's good. We're gonna have to expand a little bit on... Oh, this guy got a book! See, look! Aww. The library is up and running and he got a book! First class Nutella. What? His name! Oh, shit! <laughs> I didn't even see that. Carl First Class Nutella font. He's reading a book! Look at that. Borrowed a book from the library. Oh, everything is just going swimmingly. They produced 15 license plates already. Oh, this is great. Oh, very happy campers. <coughs> the workmen are trying to work while all these people are having showers. They're all very tired. But they'll be done soon. We're exporting good stuff. What's happening here? All these people are just kind of chilling out by the thing. They're doing some yard time. There's like a big ass yard, but they, they want to go into that part of the yard. Is anybody like working out? No, nobody's working out. Okay, I'll tell you guys what. In the yard, right, what we can do is we'll put a few chairs. Look. Yeah, look. One, two, three, four. So look. I'll put chairs in the yard so they can just chill out in the yard and sit down and have a nice day. There we go. Okay, so the shower is almost done here. It's all almost like ready to have a big massive shower bonanza. Bonanza. I love that word. Bonanza. A big shower bonanza. It's time to eat. Everybody's going to their respective canteens. And then at lockup tonight, it's time for a shakedown. And it's uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be quite a big deal the shakedown. Oh my goodness, this guy had garden shears. How did you even get garden shears, Erickson? You stupid man. This guy had a fork, Young. You look like Tupac. Why did you have a garden shears, Tupac Young? Golly. Okay. Excellent. All these people have got their food. Look, there's some, there's some, um, what's it called? It looks like bacon. It looks like there's some bacon left over. It's nice. Everybody's just chilling out. They need a little comfort, so they're sitting down. Oh, this is excellent. Okay, cool. I'm very happy right now. Uh, we have some money coming in, so it's going to soon be, once the shower is complete, which is almost there. Um, we're missing one wire before the shower will actually be complete. This guy had a cell phone again. Oh, this guy, Stone Lake. You know, Stone Lake. Stone Lake, you know what? You're going to be in lockdown for six hours. I don't even care. I don't even care. You're in lockdown for six hours because you know what? You don't learn. No, learn. I'm actually extending the long arm of the law right now about you being a terrible person. Terrible person. <sighs> okay. So, everybody's in bed, waiting to go. Let's see. Uh, medium capacity. 14 out of 23. Oh, excuse me, 23. Maximum safe capacity is 86. Shared capacity is 20. What is that? Oh, I think I may have boo-booed. I think I may have boo-booed. I did boo-boo. See, all of this here is going to be medium security only. There we go. So now we should have 28. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. I can get five more medium security guys. Uh, oh, no. Five more medium security guys and five more minimum security guys. 
Fifty fifty, yo. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. We're gonna get ten more guys in tomorrow. Uh oh, it's sleep time. Dang it, I missed lockdown. Or whatever it's called. What time is it? It's one AM. We can't do a shakedown at one AM. I think they would get slightly upset if we did a shakedown at one AM. So we're not gonna do that. What we are gonna do is um we're gonna start making room for more people it looks like we're uh we're in good shape to do this now so we're gonna get room for some more medium security guys we're gonna have to build a new laundry all oh, these are so much to do but we have actually done it we've made some license plates and that's all i wanted to do make some oh i'm, I'm broke well that's it. They got four. They got four toilets. We're we're waiting for some money. We should be getting some money in pretty quick. But the license plate's gonna be made possibly tomorrow. Uh, we're gonna be selling a bunch of stuff. This is good. Okay, very happy. It's eleven thirty. Holy crap! We've almost spent three hours a game with the prison. Yeah. Look at how nice this place is. Look at these guys. He's in this nice, nice squishy place. He really needs drugs and a shower. Paul Martin, the um, Paul Martin, the ex prime minister of Canada, has wound up in my jail, um, in cell block B. Cell A. Paul Martin? No. I forgot about that dude. <laughs> Golly. How long was he in the camp? Oh. Tim Moss. Yep. He's liberal. Okay. Everybody's sleeping. Everything's good. We're going to have a shakedown a little bit. Uh, people are, you know, getting out of jail soon. We don't have any money, so we're just going to have to wait. Oh, this is good. I think we'll get our prison up to about, what do you guys think, 150? Then we'll call it there. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see where we go. Uh, we're starting to get some money. It's coming in fairly slow. Um, I don't know how to... Okay. Deployment. Armed guard, supermax, staff only, shared, protected only. Logistics? Food distribution. Yeah. That's right. That's right. That's right. I wonder if we had like a big ass kitchen that all the food got made. What is this? Oh, I see. Laundry distribution. See, we're going to have to make a different laundry room. I believe. Room quality is crap for the most part. I bet you I could give these guys a window and just make these perimeter walls and they wouldn't be able to get out anyway. Let's do that instead. Here, let's do this. Look, perimeter wall here. Oh, that is... Okay, well, they can't get out regardless. So I could put windows in to these guys so they would actually be able to see the back of another building. That might be something fun to do. But here we go. Uh, the big morning rush for food is on. Uh, all the prisoners are going up to have showers. In, oh, Here we go. Let's have a look at the new shower. Oh, man. We need to get a guard. Um, a guard on. Oh, shoot. This isn't even a... Oh, okay. Well, we'll get a guard patrol, like, in the shower. There we go. So that way we can see all the naked guys, right? We'll be able to see if they're beating the shit out of each other. Because last time we had an altercation in our prison, it was all the guys in the showers, like, beating the shit out of each other. So, look, these guys seem pretty happy with themselves. They've all been able to have a shower. They're all clean. This guy really needs sleep. Well, you probably should have slept at night, Alex. Stupid man. Where's this guy going? Oh, he's going for a visitation. <coughs> His family is here. Visitation? Yeah. What's he in for? Uh, Beswick. Arson. He's in for arson. And Hill, he's in for assaulting an officer. I mean, and Mike Rowe. No, we're gonna sit. We're gonna rename him. Can I rename him? Character. He's only been here for two days. Wow. Well, whatever. This is great. Okay, so everybody... Oh, here's the new... 
Here's the new prisoners. Bunch of new guys coming in. We got a Henderson. We got a Speed. A, a Fache. Uh, his last name is Speed. Alex Speed. He's got. He's he's blackmailed. Well, what's going on here? Jackson? Are you being Michael, Michael, Jackson, Jackson? No, okay, he's fine. Everybody's good. Michael, Michael, Jackson. This guy's name is Dwayne Bloodleaf. He's a new guy. After his master heist, the heist got captured. While planning his next one, the heist too. He's wildly known for his eye for detail, which allows him to escape quicker. Other prisons can confirm this. Sentence to one year for joy riding. He's going to be here for three months, it looks like. Oh, this guy's working. Look at that. These guys are totally working in the shop. Yeah, they got Pringles and, like, nudie mags and all that. It's great. And these guys are working, too. He's, he's sorting the tables. Getting people, like... Oh, this is excellent. This is so good. And these guys are, are, like, wanting recreation. And that's too bad, because, Tom Brindley, you're, you're learning right now. How are you doing? He's not going to pass. Oh, somebody had a shiv down here. Who is that? It's... Jason Christensen, again. Again, are you ever going to learn? Do I have to? Oh my goodness, look, we're making license plates. Yes. 93% done our license plates. 96% done our license plates. Yay, we did our license plates. Now we can finish our cell block. Yes. Oh, somebody had booze. Can't believe it. Five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve. We're gonna have so many more prisoners. It's gonna be absolutely insanity. Uh, we need to. There we go. Righteous. Okay, cool. So now everybody's got some free time. They can do whatever they want. Look at that. See this guy here. He's exercising. Yeah, he's just running around. Mike Rowe has possibly um, done something bad again. No, he didn't. Apologies, Mike Rowe. Um, he just, like, wanted to go hang out in his prison cell. I don't blame him. He's maybe having a pee or something. I think it's, it's fine. This, this guy is, you know, doing some exercise, running around the yard. Right, everybody's kind of doing their own thing. This guy went and got a book. What is he doing right now? He's going for comfort. Now he's going to go run up. Let's watch him. Q. Oh, I see what he's doing. He's going in to the canteen, getting a nice quiet bench and reading a book. Isn't that great? Like this guy over here, he's reading a book. These guys here have a nice communal shower. Oh, look, my prison is so nice. Everybody's oh, great. Shower time again? Well, they're having, it's free time. They can do whatever they want, right? So they can have showers, they can read books, they can play pool. You know, this guy really needs drugs. Paul Martin, ex-prime minister of, you know, Canada. But otherwise, it's all good. Like, this guy really should have a nap, but he's not. So now he's being forced to go out in the yard. Why does he want a nap? Because he's, um... Oh, see? Look, this was great. It was a great idea to put the chairs oh, in the yard. The oh, who is this? Warren Newell. Newell. This guy had a lighter. Wow. Can't believe it. Oops, kick my mic. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Excellent. We've made some license plates. Oh, this is so good. Really excited about this. Okay, cool. Like, all these guys... All right. Remember, it's shakedown night tonight. Everybody's going to be searched unnecessarily, necessarily. All right, we got all the toilets in. Look at all those beds. Oh, yeah. Like, we're, we're expanding. We're expanding something big here. Something fierce is happening in the jail. Like, we're giving them some... Like bookcases here. That'll be good. Lots of bookcases. They can have their own shelf in their. Um... Okay, so there we go. This is going to have to be dismantled and moved. We're going to have to change where our light is in here. We're going to have to give them their own lights. There we go. I think we can do them a favor and actually give them their own lights in their jail cells. That'll be nice, right? I mean, a lot of these guys do have lights in their jail cells, but not all of them. So we'll actually, you know, do them a favor. Give them some lights in their jail cells. That might be nice. Hi, fans. 
Hey, Sam. Good evening. Okay. So we'll get all the, the bookcases in. That's great. Um, got all the meals and the prisoners being fed. Yeah, there's, there's enough meals and stuff to go around. I don't know why the prisoners aren't eating said meals. Oh, it's probably down here. No. I don't know why the prisoners aren't eating said meals. That's too bad. All right. Guess what? Banga? All right. Let's do a shakedown. Come on now. Everybody. It's shakedown time. It's actually almost a very fitting oh my god somebody had a pickaxe look at that a pickaxe to to dig tunnels out nobody ain't nobody ain't getting out of here soma. hey soma good evening I guess I yeah, close enough. there was a shiv in the in the kitchen that's unbelievable That's a shiv. Anything you can stab someone with is a shiv. Golly, man, I didn't know what a shiv was. What's a shiv? That's what she said. What's a shiv? All right, Laura, have a wonderful evening. Thanks for hanging out. Good night. We're doing our shakedown. Hello, Nathan. Again, you're back again. Welcome back, Nathan. Quiet for a bit. It's all good. All right. This is good. Okay. Everything's, everything's pretty happy. So we're going to have to build, like I was thinking, a bigger canteen to house all of these new people that we're going to be getting in here. Like, we are really going to be making our jail something huge. Because if you look at how many more jail cells we're getting, it is definitely quite a large number of jail cells that we are, are getting our hands on. So... So, like, cell block A is absolutely massive now. Great. Okay. So, it looks like... Oh, my God. Look at the tunnel! I've only actually been two sessions. We've only played two sessions. Um, this is session three, isn't it? This is session three. Look at the tunnels! Look at that! This son of a bitch was trying to get out! Un freaking believable. Let's have a look here. Um, no, he was just doing it mono a mono. Look at that. So, we're gonna have to uh, remove these tunnels. Can't believe it. That's why we do shakedowns, people, to try and make sure that some of these, these sons of bitches aren't gonna like tunnel out. And it would take him a really long time to tunnel out, honestly. Yeah, oh, yeah. Look, there's three dudes in the shoe. Four dudes in the shoe. Not four. Four there, none there. Yeah, there's four dudes in the shoe. I can't believe that. I just did. No. So now this guy here has to be in the holding cell for the night because of his tunneling. Oh my God, this guy built a tunnel too. Warren Hill. Warren Hill. Fuck you, Warren Hill. You're not going to do that. You're going to solitary for six hours because you're making a tunnel. Like, that is so not cool, bro. You're you're being punished. You are being punished pretty hardcore there, guy. See, I knew these bitches would be like that. All, the, all these guys have liquor over here. What is... He's in solitary too. I'm going to run out of solitary confinement. Golly. Oh my gosh. Like, this is terrible. My jail is just a, a bed of... Oh. There's another one. This guy had so many cell phones. We found 30 cell phones. Unbelievable. Alright, so these guys are fixed up. Are fixed up, uh... The tunnels in here it's almost nine hours in this in this map i think we've been doing pretty good we don't even have a hundred people in our jail yet but it, i mean we've had some pretty grown-up problems though i gotta be honest yeah somebody dropped the soap come on bros drop the soap oh yeah 
They're all looking at each other's singles. Well, you can't see them, but they're all looking at each other's singles, and you know it's true. See, this is why I give them two hours to have showers, because they all have enough time to actually get into the shower and have a gangbang and actually have a shower. See, like Boyer here, he needed a shower, right? So now everybody's able to to shower and be happy and not have to worry. And then once they're finished showering, they get to go eat breakfast. There's a big gangbang over here too. Golly. Okay, cool. So that's good. Uh, we're going to make a new laundry room. So let's see. Let's plan out a laundry room here. So I'm thinking like that. So we'll have this laundry room kind of right here. We'll have a door like right there for it. And then I was thinking about making this canteen like fairly substantial in size. And combined with that, we'll make a common room. Uh, it's the fog of war, so you can't see. So you don't have sight in those parts of your prison. Yeah. To make it di more difficult. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it might need to be four. Okay, we'll make it four then. There we go. So we'll do that. And then we can get rid of that and that. So that'll be fine. So they'll come and build a couple walls there. Um... Okay, wow. Um, we do have room for all more jail cells. I wonder if, um, if I could just sort of do that. Oh, you can. There we go. Uh, brick wall. Okay, so that. There we go. So we've done it. Wow. What else? What other grants are there? Oh, cell block D. Carpentry apprenticeship program. We'll do that. Cell block D. 200 capacity. Holy crap, adultious. All right. Oh, I keep hitting my green screen. Apologies. Uh, cell block. Okay, carpentry. Uh -huh. Produce 10 superior beds. I just have high furniture in your workshop. Do something. Carpentry courses you present your teacher value your skill. Okay, so let's do the carpentry course. Uh kitchen safety. Okay, let's see. Spiritual guidance. Carpentry. Well, we'll see what happens. No equipment. Okay, well, we won't do that. Apparently we don't have any equipment, I guess. Which is weird. We should have equipment. Well, we'll see. Uh, we'll see what we need. I'll, I'll Google it after. But there we go. We got $51,000. This is fabulous. This guy's got a lot of freedom on his mind. What we're going to do is we're going to redub this into a laundry room. Laundry room. Here. Right? And then what we'll do is we're going to dismantle all this stuff here dismantle that right and then we're going to uh wash washing machine laundry machine one two three we'll have like four of them just like that and then we'll have like a couple ironing boards like that and we'll have you know five laundry baskets there we go so we'll have like a big laundry room here um, I think we need to get water into the laundry room. We do. That's fine, because we can put small pipes into them. Just like so. Great. Okay. So we'll move the laundry over there. Um, we will get rid of that completely. So now we've installed the laundry room. So that's good. Uh, laundry basket, which is here. Which, I mean, we have a whole bunch. I don't know why... Um, they don't just put them in there. There we go. Look, this is a legit laundry room now. Great. Okay. So now we have the laundry room again. We'll employ 14 people in the laundry room. That'll be good. And then that way, the uh, the nice the nice janitors will have time to be able to do stuff. We will dismantle this and we'll put it in the laundry room facing the other way. 
Um, we're going to build another laundry room for, uh, like, the hotel area over here. I think that'll be nice. Maybe we'll put it, like, over here. Hmm. Maybe here? No. We're going to leave this so that we can put more hotel rooms in the hotel. So that'll be uh, pretty good. Great. Well, look at that. See, these guys have, you know, nice chairs to sit on. Maybe what we'll do is we'll get a few chairs for these guys in here, too. Look, objects. What happened? Hey, I'm on. Welcome back. I do remember you. There, we'll put some benches down. That way they can sit on benches while they're in the yard. All right, this is great. And now what we'll do is we're going to demolish these walls. We don't need those anymore, so we'll just demolish those out. Uh, this is great. Okay, so we have a big laundry right here. What we'll do, I mean, we have to make it really nice, I think. So we'll, make, we'll put white tiles in here. We have a whole bunch of money again, so we'll be able to, you know, like really pimp this place out. Oh, see, look at this. Be able to really pimp this place out with the white tiles because that's what you do in a laundry room, right? You put white tiles in there. Shazam. Shazam. Look at that. And this, this janitor is going along and ironing stuff and cleaning stuff up. And then this door we can dismantle. Okay, so it's this is all in an effect to make the canteen larger. So we're going to bring down the walls to there just like so and the canteen is absolutely is going to be absolutely massive so we'll do that and then what we'll do is we're going to just demolish these walls for now and that way the canteen will be really big into here so that'll be good it's a big canteen and then what we'll do is we'll expand the kitchen out and then they'll be able to um get more people in and out that'll be good okay so we have these these walls being made we got the laundry room here. I think what we can do for the laundry, we have three laundry machines and a door. Put a door there. I mean, not that it really matters, but we'll put a door there. Um, great. So that'll be good. We have room for about a million more uh, people in the jail now. Uh, we're going to move this laundry. So what we'll do is we'll get this laundry all set up to move. We're going to put that CCTV camera that we had. Uh... Like that, I think. There we go. We'll set that up there. We have a laundry basket just chilling in the middle of the ginormous canteen. So let's think about putting a new laundry room over here somewhere, I guess. Maybe we can kind of take out some of their... Mm, no, these guys need some outdoor viewage here. So we won't take it out of there. We'll put the laundry room... No, we'll probably have to expand this kitchen out here. Just put the laundry room here, I guess. Just kind of fill it up in here. So what we'll do, nice brick building. There. Build a nice brick building there for the laundry room. Hopefully this night guy won't get his um, cell all gooped up <coughs> too much. But it's, it's all good though. So we'll do that. We'll have to hook up these here. Oh, not the light. This here. How many do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, no. I disconnected everything. That wasn't good. Four, five, six, uh, seven. Eight. And this one here. One. I, I may or may not have unplugged my CCTV monitors by accident. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. That's probably going to have to be. There we go. Everything's hooked up again. P-Tech says that he's really happy to be sleeping in his own bed. Because whenever he goes to a hotel, he thinks what sort of sick shit happened in the bed that I'm sleeping in. I think about that too. And every time I go in a hotel 
like room i can't uh ever well that and they're always lumpy and i never am comfortable and i always have problems with my back with them I've only ever stayed at your hotel once and that's when it was brand new and there wasn't jizz all over the bed and like and like hookers and whatever. Oh, nights. There we go. And then I guess we'll put a door here. And we'll put a brick wall here. Okay, so we'll let that get all built up. That's going to be the new laundry room for the for the the small guys we're gonna extend the kitchen down a little bit more so that way um, obviously it's gonna be bigger it's great okay so that'll do that oh, this is excellent surprise but thank you for the follow welcome to the name of Empire thanks for hanging out with us tonight it, it honestly 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 means a lot for us to us that you guys are are uh, hanging out and uh, spending choosing to spend your night here with us live on our silly little show so it muchly I muchly 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 appreciate it so we we thank you very much what's going on night I'm sorry night that your room is kind of messed up right now um, the men are coming to fix it up and there you go look your cell is all fixed up and you didn't sleep all night i apologize jerry jackass night but uh you know then be the breaks all right so how are we do for power we might need another power supply soon uh we will we definitely will um but for now we'll just sort of wing it do that and then we're gonna get so what we'll do We'll get what? There we go. Small pipes, just like so. What? No, no, no. I want to hear about this. Did I not tell you about the one time? I get like creepy crawlies just thinking about it. You got to tell us about bed bugs in hotels because then you'll make people not ever want to go back to a hotel ever again. So, when you stay at a hotel and they have had bed bugs, so what they do is front desk gets informed that there's bed bugs you actually go up and make sure that they're bed bugs and not some other kind of bug i know what a bed bug looks like Gross. and what you have to do is you call mr orkin because orkin is the pest control man and he comes to the hotel and he goes up to the room and then he have to put the room out of order and the rooms beside it and above it and below it and across the hall from it all of the ones surrounding all four corners uh-huh then you put it off market for I think it's 48 hours. They treat it. Treat it being they put a bag around the mattress. Yeah. And they, like, spray some kind of, like... Yeah, yeah. They gas it. Yeah. Like gas it. And then so you can't go into the room or touch it or anything like that for, I think it's 48 hours. And then Mr. Orkin comes back and checks the bugs, removes the bag from the mattress. Yeah. And then you have to sell that room within, I think, three days? Four days. However many hours. So you sell that room and then you get the people into bed and then if there's any bed bugs that didn't get treated, they crawl back out, up from the bed, bite the people, and then you know that the bed bugs aren't dealt with. So then you put the room back off marching again, call Orkin back, Orkin does the whole mattress, you can find, you know, yeah. bag over top, spray it again, do the exact same process three times, and then you just leave it. Within three times they should be gone if they're not gone. Gone well. <laughs> well, you're fucked. I like that. You're fucked. But yeah, so yeah, they don't actually get rid of them right away, but they put in some poor innocent soul to get bitten by the bugs. Well, you gotta find out, and I guess. You gotta pull them all out. Yeah. Hotels that have wooden bed frames are the worst for it because they can live inside the wood. Right. There we go. So we got a new laundry room. Well, wow, that was great. I don't ever want to go to a hotel again. Okay. We've only had a hundred basket. Laundry basket, ironing board, so they're getting installed. Oh, this needs power. Oh, no. Okay, well, this might throw us into a blackout. So we're going to have to... Oh, yeah. Have a, have a pee. Have a wee there, buddy. 
Beck Slatter. Okay, so. Nathan wants to know when do you stream? How often? Well, how do, how often do we stream? Um, typically most most weeknights. Um, most weeknights until about midnight. Like right now, we're gonna be wrapping it up pretty quick. Um, I'm gonna actually change up. We're gonna probably cancel a couple days during the week and stream on the weekend. So that way, if you guys, probably like Saturday night, more than likely we'll stream. Cause that way you don't have to, you know, do homework and stuff on Saturday night. So you'll be able to enjoy, you know, hanging out with us on Saturday night. Um, but typically, yeah, typically we stream every day of the week. Oh, wow, look, there's people have been assigned to these new prisons or cells. That's very interesting. So, yeah, we're usually here. Come on, put the cable in. So, yeah, we try and stream as much as we can, though, for sure. Minimum security. There we go. Well, actually, that doesn't have to be minimum security, does it? Eh, well, well no. It theoretically doesn't have to be minimum security. It's shared. That laundry is shared. That's fine. There we go. So now we have like two laundries kind of spread out between the two. These guys don't get a laundry because they're, I mean, hardened criminals. And look at this guy. He found a weapon. That's too bad, buddy. Shouldn't have, shouldn't have, you know, been terrible like that. Okay. Great. So now we have... The new laundry room here. Um, this is excellent. Okay, cool. Hey, well, wow. Our prison is, has become massive. Yeah, I bet. So, there we go. Apologies about my stupid thing in the background today look what we'll do is we'll kind of scroll over so that you can't really see it apologies about my stupid green screen in the background um it, i will attempt to fix it tomorrow i've never had weird problems like this with it before until i changed up my streaming computer so um apologies about that uh what do you guys want to watch tomorrow do you guys want to watch some more prison architect i'm totally fine playing that a little bit oh actually no i lied we're not gonna be on tomorrow um we have to do some paperwork tomorrow, Amanda and I, to do some, you know, money stuff. Like, some grown-up stuff. We I don't know why we actually have to do it, because we're grown-ups. I think that's why we have to do it. So, we won't be back tomorrow. We'll be back on Friday. So, uh, stay tuned to Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, all that stuff. We do post infrequently, I admit. But uh, we'll, we're trying to post a little bit more. sometimes we post three times a day. Yeah, so we'll, we'll try and post a little bit more for you guys on those. Um, this weekend, or coming up tomorrow, I'll be more than likely giving away a copy of Awesome Knots, a Steam key for Awesome Knots. So if you guys want, not tomorrow, on Friday. So if you guys want to win that, I don't know if it's free to play. Is it free to play? If it is, well, you get a Steam key from me anyway. Um so we'll be doing that probably on Friday. So if you guys want to get something, I have two copies, one for people on YouTube and one for people on Twitch. So that will happen. Yeah. So otherwise, that's it. That'll do it for us tonight. Um, oh, ooh, somebody had a fork. Anyway, everybody, have a wonderful evening. Thank you all for hanging out. What? A fork? Yeah, somebody had a fork. Thank you all very much for hanging out. Thank you to all of the new people who hit that follow button. It really, 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 really helps us out. Thank you all to all the new people that have come and hung out with us on YouTube. You guys are awesome. YouTube gaming is a cool new community that we would like to get more uh, into. So thank you very much for hanging out. Nathan and Amon and Lore and all those guys. So it's great having you all around. So thank you all very much for watching and have a wonderful evening uh the ending song is called i fight for you by morgan page which believe it or not is a dude have a wonderful evening we'll see you all on friday good night bye, bye. I God, I hope to see the freeze up today. gonna have to count your losses it is it is Easily oh there we go attracted but dangerous to get distracted i'm drawing circles don't you know 
dare to see the walls to go away.